Good afternoon. Yeah. Hi. Hello. How are you? I'm great. I just want to let the people know that I did pay five thousand dollars to be a <laughs> co-host for uh, an hour. And there you have it. But no, like, so this was really. I see y'all see the title say Testa. One of my good friends. I think a, a few of you may know her. She go by the name of um, Brianna Pettyville Simone. Mm -hmm. She had made a promise when we were leaving the spaceship about an hour ago. I'll say that she would be coming live and blah blah blah. Mm-hmm. And blah blah blah. Yeah. So I sent her a message a moment ago. You know, we talk mm -hmm. behind the scenes occasionally. Mm -hmm. Um, sent her a message and I'm like, Are you going? Because I'm over here watching Eat with Q. She just scarfed down uh um Oh my god, did you see those big ass bites she was taking? That, Chipotle bowl. that girl is my she's like my shero. I don't eat like that because you know, she be throwing down and I love me some eat with Q and her mama Diani. Shout out to Miss Diani. Mm -hmm. Um I was over there watching her scarf down her Chipotle. It made me really want some, but I mean, whenever I get it, it's never that good. Um, but then I hit up Miss Bree and I'm like, hey, you didn't go live. And she said StreamYard wouldn't let her. And mm. I know several people were saying, and even when I went into the StreamYard application, it said that there were issues connecting. I didn't know that Miss Honey Love was a mod of hers until I got over there. <laughs> but my good friend, Too Strong, is a mod over there too. And then I'm friends with her mom, Miss Diani. But um. Junetta knows a lot of people in high places, darling. I see. I'm glad I have her in my on my corner as well. Mm -hmm. And we will never respect and call her honey love. <laughs> no, we will not. So I'm Molly, not sure. me, you, her, Molly. Right. Molly. I'm not sure why she changed her name, but fuck that. Okay, Junetta. People we, who yeah. know her, they damn sure will go call her Junetta, regardless. Right, right. But um, yeah, but Bree said that she couldn't go live based on StreamYard, and it did give a warning. So I did click it to see. It's 120 of us here now. So I mean, I guess we're gonna stay. For a little bit, at least. Should we do a poll? I mean, was Brie lying? Number uh, eight. Yeah. Should we do a poll? And look, and just to put a little sugar on top of the salt. Um, mm -hmm. So I, I just when I just went live, I sent her the link and I said, hey, it's working for me. She said, child, I'm in a car now. I don't know what that means. Uh, well, I think I do. But I, I think she probably continued on with her day. <laughs> yeah. So, so Brie, if you can hear this shade being tossed upon you, just know that it's said with love, my dear. Sprinkle, sprinkle, salt, salt, darling. And I'm well, only here to, to fill the dead space because, like, we really had nothing going on that I could see. My God. And I was trying to get through work, and I just wrapped it up. I ordered my food, and because uh, I'm not in the cooking mood uh, uh, this week, I guess. I ordered my food, and I'm about to pour a drink. What time is it? I guess it's five o'clock somewhere. Five o'clock somewhere. Cheers. Indigo. Indigo said, why y'all got the cute ODS emoji and I got the poopy smiley face? I don't know if it's based on the time. I know <laughs> the, um, for the first month, I thank you the Globe. And then, I don't know, baby, but my bad. Let me drop this mukbang channel that somebody just asked for. Hold hey, on. Jills, and everybody who spoke that I miss. Welcome, y'all. What do you call your people again? They're the Yardigans. The Yardigans. It's a cute name. Thanks hey, to um, Faith Yaya, she came up with that. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, because, you know, I call it the yard and then mm -hmm. like the black um, character um, cartoon, mm -hmm. the backyard again. Yeah. So not to be childish, but there's the link to my mukbang channel. We have Rodney in the back. Hey, Rodney. Oh. Hey. What's Juicy going on? booty. Nothing much. Hey, fancy. Hey, honey. <laughs> How y'all doing? Um, mm -hmm. is, it is really not too much going on, is it? Uh, I was mm -hmm. thinking about going live probably like a um within a couple of days but i don't think it's really anything going on but i could just strike up alive and just shoot the shits or whatever that's it now rodney you're gonna have to get out of that couple of days thing because once you become a consistent um youtuber you have to come at least every three i say that not even live in like five days but i was gonna say least... rodney you don't have to do anything darling you could be like sassy and never come live, and then people don't know who you are and they don't respect you. I mean, either way. not to no respect you. I wish them hoes would. What's up, D Dot? Yeah, but um, what were you saying, Rodney? You you think you will go live? Yeah, go break, go Yeah, probably within a couple of days. Um, I'm yeah. not for sure. Yeah, I mean, hey, yeah. listen, you'll find your own groove. You know what I mean? Hey, messy. Right. Yeah, 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 but um, you, oh, I can find something to talk about. Taking less over there, Rodney. I will say that. What you say? You've been doing well with facilitating mess over there, hasn't he? Let's oh, let yeah, and you really have, newbie. I keep missing you. Like I felt well, like thank y'all, thank y'all. I've been bad. Hey, newbie. Uh, yeah, you really have, and I mean, and you know what was ironic? You got me to my destination on the airplane, 
<laughs> and then back home. And you, so you came live on a Thursday and you came live on a Monday. And I was like, this is right on motherfucking time. What's yeah. that? Oh, wow. Well, thank you, Sassy. I appreciate that. Yeah, and I look forward to it. It's 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 mess, but it's it's organized chaos. You know what I mean? So right, right. <laughs> we all offer a little bit of mess. Right, right. We have to. I mean, that's what we're here for. But you know, it can be organized mess. It's kind of very uh D spot ish, you know, over there. It's not too crazy. I and I right. like that. I don't mind yeah. that. I don't mind it. I don't mind and, it at all. And you know what? I don't mind uh, the mess, but you know, I don't want it to get too out of hand, though. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. yeah. Now, Rodney, what I will tell you is, when it gets a little out of hand, go with it. As long as they're not disrespecting your platform with the verbiage that they well, I can't tell about how to run that platform. Oh Let well, yeah. What well, you know? What? Yeah, you're right. But you're right, though. You're right. You're right. But when it happens, as long as it's natural and it's organic, let it go. Um, right. I don't try to break up fights over here. Like when people get into it on the panel, that's your business. That's your that's your situation. Right. You're not held right. accountable. You don't have to come back and apologize for anything that happens. People understand. Um, my can you can one of y'all grab Rodney's link, please? We got a few people. Stop moving questions. your mic, honey. Sorry. Oh well, thank you, me. thank you. Like, share, and subscribe, people. <laughs> um, I will say, Rodney, don't be like Ben's if she's in the audience. That don't don't get too so flustered and just cut the live like that's that's not a good look. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. 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 I was like, dang, why did she uh, cut the live? You know. Yeah. I was like, she wow. gotta you, you gotta stand in your shit and be able to you know just gather them. And before I cut my live, them hoes will be gone. You know what I'm saying? Right. 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 right exactly. Exactly. Yes. I apologize. Yeah. I didn't speak to people in the chat. No, I but I wouldn't have cut my live. I wouldn't have done that. No. Uh. -uh. Yeah. Rodney, you be Rodney. <laughs> he got a slight delay. Uh-uh. R.N.Y. talking about Rodney. Why did she call you Fruity Booty yesterday? <laughs> that shit was so funny. Uh, I tell you, it was so on point. That, like, that, she uh, just came out of nowhere with it. That old drunk ass woman up there, she'll say anything. I don't think that no shit mind. was so fucking funny, Rodney, because you did not deserve none of that shit. Right. She, exactly. she was supposed to be cussing me out. <laughs> right. She was supposed I to be cussing me out. I already knew why she had called me up there. LG Ooh, missed me. Funny. I hadn't picked on LG in some weeks. So LG was missing me because I had been ignoring oh, her. Oh, but baby's oh. on now. Oh, hey, it's on. on. What you mean? With who? With her. It's on, baby. Oh, is, oh you mad? No, I ain't mad. It's I, all, I, no, it's I, I, no, it's I, I spoiled no. it. My bad. Let's start over. Oh, you gonna get a right? <laughs> get a right. I'm gonna right. get her. I'm gonna get her. <laughs> no, nah, but I don't pay. I don't pay her no mind. Shit, I don't yeah, pay. You can't, miss. You, you can't pay LG no. You mind. can't let none of these people work you up, especially the regular. Right. They get into their feelings because they're not gonna remember the next day, and you gonna still be in your feelings. So exactly. Baby, you, you <laughs> that's why I never have. Let it go. <laughs> so me and me and um. I have gone back and forth with TG before. I mean, LG before. I refuse to be a fool. That's like arguing with a wall. But I did go up yesterday. What's up, St. James? Because I don't know. I felt like that panel was crazy, first of all. Oh my the characters God. that was the up there. The first one or the second one? Was that the first one or the second one? I don't even remember where the fuck I was. Like, to tell you the truth, where were we? We were at Ness, right? Yeah. But Ness's okay. panels always. What I'm up. saying was that the morning live or the late night live? That was the morning because I was sleeping. Okay, right okay, now. okay. That morning live was everything to me. I had a. But you just crash. reminded me, Ness. If you in here, drop down. Who the fuck was that man, Ness? Did we ever oh, find exactly. who that man was? I asked her five times last night. That's the only reason why I came in there, and she would not answer my question. Ooh, was I that, why um, I said she went to another live and said Fruity Booty and ODS is together. I ain't know that. Ah. See, I'm gonna have to cuss LG ass out when I see her. <laughs> Everybody pass along the word, child. ODS and Rodney are together, child. Hey, we both all over um Twitter, so go for it. Look. Hey. <laughs> so but, wasn't it, if I'm not mistaken, was that a uh, guy named Rex up there on uh Nissa's uh, platform? Thank you, no, Anthony. We're talking last about night he was. Okay, yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about the guy who we're talking about her sneaky link. Uh, uh no, this was in the second live because I did do some red balling and I saw that. Up, oh, look at the people falling out the sky. Let me look real quick. Let's look. Um, welcome to the membership. My flower Lachey always here. Juicy review always here. Miss Rhonda oh, B. Good. My boo Pretty got chocolate one. girl. I'm that messy strawberry. Black Pearl. St. James. Lincoln Berry. Stacy Roberson and Bold and Beautiful. Y'all all welcome to the membership. I'll do something special soon so that way y'all can get some benefit. Hey Max. Hey everybody that's coming in. Mm -hmm. Um, I didn't really have any commentary planned because I wasn't going to be here. Something did happen yesterday. I kind of want to speak on it, even though they said they didn't want to talk about it. 
I got to talk about it because my people talking about it behind the scenes. So yesterday I was minding my business. I was out and I ended up at Diva Tomboyish. I love me some Diva. A lot of people feel a different way about her. So when I got into her chat, she was speaking. Um, she Beasley was there. Fleas. Let's say Fleasley. Fleasley was there and he was in the chat talking all kinds of shit about me and oh, I'm sucking dick and I'm doing this. Oh I'm doing that. First of all, sir, whatever the fuck I do with my mouth, my mind, my body is my motherfucking business. Hey, Bill. Um, nobody else's. So for him to say that, it pissed me off. She had just threw a, threw a blue wrench on me. So, bitch, I sure enough timed his ass out for five minutes. I don't know why I did that because I definitely ruffled some feathers with my good friend, Miss Diva. And oh, Ms. Diva really? went off. She went off. She kept it respectful with me for the most part, but she was just like, um, she was saying something to the effect of that's why she don't talk about who her favorites is because then if stuff happened and they end up fucking up their relationship. Then long story short, we walked out of there on good terms. But I did say go ahead and take that wrench because what I won't do is be in a place and I own a wrench and not be able to time out a person that's disrespecting me. That's right. Um, so yeah, and yeah, I get that. I, I don't I care. Know. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Just, how is that? A Let me speak on my panel, please. I'm just playing. Yeah. But I don't give a fuck how petty it was. If I don't fuck with you like that, don't come in here disrespecting me and think that I ain't gonna zap your ass. If I had right. a relationship or any type of rapport with you, that's one thing. Because I'm never sensitive. But this is a dirty, nasty motherfucker who don't even belong to fuck over here with us. So why? Well, that won't even our place. I was in her place. So yes, I was out of line. But I had a blue rent, so I felt like it was okay. But I, I did say go ahead and take it. And then that was a trigger, apparently, because I didn't know that she had went through a situation where somebody told her to take it before and her cookie fell out. I don't know. At the end of the day, me and her cool. Um, I told her I didn't need it. Um, but I'll still be there. But I'm going to defend myself if a motherfucker there talking shit. And if I got a blue wrench, I'm gonna time your motherfucking ass out. It's just it is what it is. And I ain't gonna do no 24 hours and no dumb shit. I'll do one minute, one minute, five minute at the most. But like right. no, I'm disrespecting me saying no fuck ass dumb shit. You nasty, why are right. you claiming that that's petty? That's not petty. That's fucked up on his part. How does why does he think that he can come into a space where you have a a, a wrench and say really derogatory vile things to you? It wasn't like oh you got big lips. That's nan and a poo poo. This is like real nasty vile shit. That's not petty Looking for attention and nobody was even paying him any mind. That's so like I said, you bitch. Yeah, yeah. Like how did like at the, the end of the day we was able to get through it. I still stayed through the live because I was enjoying what the commentary was. Um, I did want to have that conversation with her because I like her. Like, I love her news recaps and somebody don't do them like they used to. Um, so she put provides a name on it, nigga. Put a name on it. So I cannot. So she said, why not block him? All right. I can't block him in somebody else's chat if I have a wrench. She can't. Yeah, we can't block. That's disrespectful as a bitch if I go in there and rock. Now, if I would have blocked him, she should have cussed me the fuck out from the door, like to the floor. Like, but yeah. I did. I only did a little quick time out or whatever, which still in turn, like wasn't on the best thing but i mean it is what it is so it's um but deal. just take the wrench it's not a big deal yeah I and so i said just take the wrench deal, like i didn't I'm first of all i didn't ask for it she only gave it because she yeah. she she liked she has an you know a likeness about me which i can respect but no let's go yeah ain't no big no, it's so not come pillow talk. i would need to have blocked him on my own turf or in somebody else's and normally if he's talking shit somewhere i'll talk shit back but if I'm not discussing you and I ain't got nothing to do with the conversation, pay attention to what the fuck going on. I shouldn't be mentioned in Diva's chat at any point, like by him as a subby. Like, why the fuck are you bringing me up? You talking real yeah, fast. Yeah, but I. You don't always talk fast. Oh, go ahead, Rodney. But yeah, um, I'll, I I told my I think I told my moderators uh, if anybody disrespecting you, I already know what to do on that. So. I don't mm -mm. I don't mind disrespect either, but like bitch, don't just come in here saying no dumb shit. First of all, right. you won't even fucking here in 2019, you nasty homeless bitch. Like Yeah, if they if, yeah, if they on some totally, you know, fuck shit and, and obviously if they trolling, then yes, go ahead and yeah. So she said, I said I say it's petty because it's not his channel. Timeouts and blocks affect the channel holder more than the mods. So timeout doesn't affect the channel holder at all, actually. Because like I could go time you out right now and it doesn't affect anybody else here. Nobody cares. It doesn't stop the show. You know what I'm saying? Like, so a timeout ain't really there's only one diva, Levon. La I mean, what what other diva would you be thinking about? Diva Tomboy. What other diva you talk? Yeah. Yeah. You know I how to look at the members. So let me if I see find out. Hold on, let me see. I was just saying, you know how Levon is about her question. So if I see her, sometimes I'll pick on her. But what other diva were you thinking of, Levon? But yeah, what you saying? Now, I mean, I got mods who used to come. My mods don't really do it anymore. Now, if Dive and Doctor drop down, she probably would get. Now, it. now I got to down. admit, but I didn't. I didn't say nothing. No DS. The last time I did drop down in your chat, I was timed out, but I didn't say anything. 
and I'm, I'm pretty sure this. I know who it was. But I would say I I'm have about... to check to see. More than anything, it probably would have been Pizarro because she don't. Oh, yeah. Well, no, BL don't have a problem with you. I don't think so. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think it was Pizarro. Um, just, now BL, now now BL was timing me out when when me and Pizarro when we was in a good space. Now she would she timed me out over uh in Pizarro's chat, and oh, I said okay, right. well, huh. You sure get timed out a lot. I don't know what what why you irritate so people so much. You think and but that's the thing, Sassy. When I drop down in, in these chats, I don't say nothing out the way. I, I'm I'm always um, you know, re, you know, respectable and and you know and just re support the host, you know. And then they'll just uh, time you out for for no damn reason. And so uh, you know, just for you know, this paid being paid, I guess. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think you might be partially still in your hazing phase, I guess. Mm, possibly. So mm -hmm. I guess they I guess when I, I guess when I speak, I guess when I speak a whole lot, I get a lot of people's attention for some reason. I don't know why. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, so. we've always I've always been fond of you, but I do know people who be like, uh, and I'll be like, what do you do to y'all? Right. Is that yeah, exactly. I don't be doing shit uh now. Like I say, I voice my opinion and that's it. As mm. you should. But you know, uh, you but be yeah, talking but, shit though. You be talking shit, right? Yeah, but I talk it at the right <laughs> time though. Okay. Well, hey, I hey, <laughs> I, I like shit talking, so I don't give a. Yeah, shit. somebody I, said, I "Who cares, Rodney? You have a channel." Now I, I do agree because you have a channel. Instead of getting up there and going at them, I will go to my channel and I will just drag whoever it is, and then do your fifteen right. minutes of drag and cut it off. Look, at, look at highlight spam calling. I I I be spam so I time out the gaze. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But who was that picture? <laughs> spam, who was that with the red hair? A lot going on, Spam. You ought to be ashamed of yourself, Spam. So it's a Queen Diva, Diva One, and Diva Tomboys. But out of those three, only one of them is really a content creator. <laughs> she know that. I mean, it's just ridiculous. Oh, Miss LeBron responded. Hold on, let me look. Miss LeBron said, Black Pearl, hey boo, I'm that messy. No, I didn't see your response. Let me look up again. Do you see it, Sass? I'm not looking because I don't okay. care. She's a bitch. <laughs> she, oh, okay. oh. But anyway, yeah, I don't have a problem with uh, Diva either uh, at all. She reminds me of Max-ish. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. uh, Haley Andrews smooches. Uh, but yeah, I don't. That doesn't. That's not a big deal. It's just I was talking more about the people coming in the chat saying vile things. If you say something vile about me and I got a and I got a, a mod stick, it's a wrap. Like I'm not playing with you. Are you crazy? Now, Betty, I don't want everybody to come over here because I won't go stay here for long. So I don't know if I want to edit the name or not. <laughs> How many people are now, here? Somebody, three, yeah, some of these uh, moderators. That's enough. Mm -hmm. Um, I was supposed to be at work, y'all, but I got bored with work. So I text my manager and said, I'm done for the day. It's my Friday anyway. Um, Now, in six minutes. Dougie Fresh. I may disappear because, you know, my man goes to break and we smoke at four. So hopefully he'll come up here. I got the chair already right there from earlier. So hopefully he'll come. No mistakes. I didn't cut my hair. That was old pictures. Those are old pictures that the um the homeless man with the flies on his face said that because he talked about my hairline, when he has no room to talk about anything, he said that I started showing old pictures because of that. Oh, God. These people are so hey, delusional. Girl. Oh, I wanted to say this, what happened on Lady Nika's uh, platform the other day. Are y'all familiar with this subscriber called Leanders? Leanders. Leand, whatever you uh, Okay, whatever. we like Leanders is old school and we like her, but go ahead with your story. Uh why lightly, she, but you won't come up here. Look. Because okay. She, yeah, no, she uh, she actually came up on Lady Nico's lean. <laughs> you know, uh saying that let me, let me tell you this real quick, because a lot of people who might be like newer than two years or new, you you, uh -huh. guys, you guys probably don't know Leandris, but we do. So she's old school beef sector. Okay. She definitely would click links occasionally. We know a lot about her. So I'm just, I just, I'm not to stall you from saying anything you're about to say. I don't think I can, but I just wanted, I was thinking about that as I was watching that interaction and say, oh, he probably doesn't even know like who really Leandris is. So I just wanted to let you know. 
Okay, well, I don't like it. But anyway, I don't uh, have to talk about that. But anyway, moving right along. No, I didn't want to stop you. I know it's fair game. I'm not saying don't talk about it. I just was saying. No, well, I, was... I guess she thought she was going to get Lady Nika to turn against me because of what I said in my commentary. Yeah, I said what I said and I meant what I meant. If I drop down in her chat and then moderators uh, fuck with me over there, then I won't Then I won't come back. You know, yeah, I said I won't. Uh, wouldn't be back on the platform if that happened. And and I have a right to um and if I drop down in the chat regardless, that's my right, you know. Um that's my right to change my mind. I have the right to do that. How long but ago she made it, okay. but she I guess she made it seem she tried to make it seem like I was just so bad, like I was just over there talking about uh Lady Nika, you know, in the platform. But I said no, mm -hmm. I mean what I said. I remember so I, I think I heard it. How long ago had you said that? That was like, ooh, that was like in Maybe like almost like a week ago or something like that. A little okay. bit over a week. Mm -hmm. I kept asking in the chat and nobody knew. But I thought so. I thought I kept it like it could have been 10 days, two weeks, something like that. Yeah, something like, like that. Yeah, no, uh -huh. it wasn't here recently. No. Mm -hmm. uh -uh. Recent, but not yesterday. I guess. Yeah, recent, yeah, I yeah, but not yesterday. Right, right. No, she says she don't like you either. So it's it's all good. Y'all can just avoid each other. She I says don't she give a damn. I ain't never done nothing to that damn lady. I ain't never done nothing to, the, to a fuck her. Yeah, so what happened? She cussed him out. No, I cussed her out. Ooh. Um, sassy. I got another one of them nasty. So I got like three left. You think it's nasty? <clears throat> so I've been putting a little Mio in it. Uh huh. Just to I've take never, it. I've never had that before. And to keep me from drinking soda. So. Well, <laughs> at least it's working. And listen, what you? I'm that messy trying to be messy with her messy ass. Hold on, let me get it. Is that Leandris right there? That should go in the chat. <laughs> that we've been talking, she's been talking the whole time. She's telling me she's gonna put on all caps, and I don't like you either. <laughs> I don't give a damn girl. Uh, you can go straight to here, kiss my damn ass. That's what now, you Angelica can do. said he cried about something that happened at 1870. <laughs> 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 Highlight on that messy comment if you can find she, it. Like she, she had no business it. hitting no damn link to telling Lady Nika shit about what I said. Lady Nika can go over there and look at the commentary for a damn self. Oh, so it was something about Lady Nika you had said. Yeah, now, it was no, it was some about all of them. It, you know, uh, I when I was uh talking about my commentary, I was talking about the moderators, you know, being petty in general. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And I just and Lady Nika was one of the platforms that I named off. I named off several platforms. You see what I'm saying? Not just hers. You was bothered though, so I could see why Leandris that you know, I could see uh I could see both sides. You didn't highlight it. Now I gotta go back. And I was find trying it. to find it. I was I, but I was going up too high, so I didn't know if I had uh okay hold on because i want to talk about this because these hoes gonna try to blame me for this shit hold on i'm that messy said sassy coercing there you go sassy coercing the whole chat talk that woman into donating instead of what she oh on Pizarro. <laughs> so i got what you were saying i was like lord i hope it don't look like she hating all that lady money but i was thinking the same thing yeah, now, mind you, i was walking into mcdonald's because i went they got um spicy nuggets back y'all they were mm. pretty good with some honey hey chefy mm -hmm. Um, it's open panel, so if anybody want to come up, y'all can. But um, I was thinking the same thing, like, and this is no disrespect to that lady or to Pizarro or nothing. If you want to give her the hundred dollars, just give it a hundred dollars. It shouldn't be contingent upon if that man's coming or not, especially if you're not representing for the man. So I thought she was one of his people, and she's like, MBK, I'm acting like I don't know him. I thought she was one of MBK supporter, and she's like, I want to make sure he get there. She's like, No, I just want to make sure Pizarro get her money. Get it. Hey, Shaker. So just send her the hundred dollars and I don't How do I feel about that? I don't have a problem with it because I like MBK. He's cool. He brings a different perspective. Hey, birthday twin. Um, we got what 19. We got nine days, 19, 19 days till our birthday. Um, I don't have a problem with MBK, but I don't know if I want to see him at the spaceship for a two-hour show. Like, yes, give us 30 minutes and you can give a different point of perspective, and hopefully it'll be a topic included, but just for everyday girl chat. That would seem awkward to have a man on the panel. So, listen, um, I, I, I asked, I'm going to try those this weekend, y'all. I thought you tried Poppy. It's too I expensive. Didn't. I saw them in the store yesterday. They was like two dollars a can. It's too expensive. It, it doesn't two dollars a can at public. My um, clearly Canadian is two dollars a bottle. So I would rather get that. At least I know I like it. It's too. It's too expensive, and it's not all that. Uh, and I take a pro probiotic every day, so I don't need my soda to, or my sparkling water to have a probiotic. But nevertheless, that's just my opinion on that. Um, Hazel birthday next Friday, y'all. She could drop her cash app, and y'all can hit my cash app too if you like. <laughs> 
Um, I don't want that. Listen, I know you guys love to spin narratives and to blame Sassy for something. I didn't coerce that lady into doing anything. I asked a series of pertinent questions and she came to her own conclusion. And that's what happened. Oh, I want to ask you. So are you in? Uh oh. Hello, hey, what's up? Uh, hey, how you doing? Don't say uh oh, Rodney. Hey, Sassy, how are you? <laughs> Hey, honey, you doing the shade. How you doing, Sassy? I'm doing good, honey. What about you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm gonna. You go know, I hate to throw a little shade you know. when you come up. I get here, it. Uh, I get it. But I want to be a nice girl, so you know, I want okay. you to have a conversation. What were you gonna ask, Rodney? Oh, uh, are you in uppity still? Um, in a bad place? Cause I thought you and her was okay at one point in time. Damn you. That was months and months ago. I mean, uppity got mad at me like in. I don't know, dare I say October-ish or something after I did a live on her. Oh, okay. okay. No, it's been a long okay. time, but now I just really enjoy antagonizing her, chastising her, and making fun of her. So I'm having a ball. Oh, say. <laughs> oh, I know that's right. I I just, I'm not, I don't, I'm not like a lot of these people or I guess a handful of these people who I really enjoy. like hate you and, and are disturbed by your presence and all that. I don't get into that. That's too, um, that's too mean and ugly for me. Yeah, I just, that's too deep, isn't that's it? That's too deep. Yeah, like yeah. for me, uh, it's just a matter of like, either I fuck with you or I don't. And if I don't, I'm going to fuck with you. Okay? That's Yo, it. I've been Let's feeling gags, the same honey. way. Been gags. Let's I've get been well, feeling the same way. You should. You're yeah. just a big old troll anyway. Not a big old troll, but yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't mean him. I did not mean that. But yeah, she be trolling in a slick way. She trolls in a slick way. She does. And I think, I'm hey, a big old troll. I said, wait a, wait a minute. Right, there's a comment on the screen for you, baby. Sorry, you know I'm cute. You know, you, you know, Sassy had to get with you. Bia, I'm don't like, tag me, honey. Sassy, let him know. I'm ugly, Sassy. Spam. I don't think you're ugly. And I would not, I, I wouldn't think you were ugly, but um, I don't think you're ugly. Have they not seen you come up this year? Who are you talking about? You, well, you sassy. Oh no, she wasn't calling me ugly. Nobody, oh. would, nobody would call me ugly, darling. That's what, oh, right. Sassy they is not talking ugly. about sassy is pretty. Sassy is gorgeous. Sassy just doesn't lead with her looks. So they get confused, child. They get right. confused. If you're so pretty, why wouldn't you show us? Cause I don't have to, bitch. When she was sitting out at the restaurant and Sassy is pretty. Yeah, Sassy oh, is no, beautiful. I know Sassy pretty. I think people got gagged when she was on the aeroplane. Remember the aeroplane? Oh, you popped on camera. Tits, showing her tits. Yeah. I was not showing my tits. Stop it. Yeah, you sounded <laughs> like Lori yesterday. Did you Sassy, you caught the shade and I caught it at the same time. Hey, Fifi. Um, when Lolo came on camera after she saw Brooke and LG. <laughs> she didn't put on the yellow so bra. And then, that shit yeah. was so funny. And then Lori went and started. grabbed the first yellow bra she could, the first yellow oh. item she could find. She set them titties in her lap and she said, Bitch, I have can on you camera. do a poll? On what? To do what? Who, who had the best, Gosh. maybe? Okay, it was a lot going on. The glasses, the hair, and the yellow uh, bodice or whatever. Like, who had the best? I don't know. Like it was so many things to judge upon. Brooke was giving original, what you call it, was giving her possessed. Twin. I don't know. I, I vote for LG. I vote for LG. You see the difference? You oh, know. are we? Are you saying we're trying to vote between the three who was the prettiest? Yes! Oh, Brooke, 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 be, Brooke, y'all be hating. I'm never going to put women in the post like that and, I'm just and talk about their looks. I don't have the rights to well, do I that. Will. Right, I will. Brooke, me too. All three, all three of them are very attractive. <laughs> <laughs> Let me say, not very attractive. All three of them are attractive women, right? But and sassy LG had the hair, but and then did you see the glasses? And then oh now LG God. got pretty hair. She has pretty oh, hair. Right? Did you, you see it flowing? Hair. Brooke, I, I, your hair is gorgeous. Even though well, she called me fruity booty, but ugly. that's fine. I'm just saying, who was? But anyway, pretty? so your vote, Sheffy, is LG. What's your vote, Rodney, of the three? Yeah. I you know what? Can I take my vote to Lolo? You can't keep voting. Just vote. Can I vote? Can I change it? Like, okay, go ahead. But okay, you okay, okay, LG and who? Because I didn't hear of LG, Lo Lolo, and Brooke. Uh, I would say Brooke. I like Brooke. I like okay. Brooke has pretty hair to me also. 
Okay, go go, Chefy, since you wanted to change it. Okay, thank you. I I appreciate it. I would like to vote for Lolo, mostly because yeah. although she was a late entry into the competition that we were always gonna judge her upon, you mm -hmm. know, she had a different hair with the locks that was colored. And yeah. she also had jewelry in her locks, which I always love. Um, you know, I don't really care about the yellow or whatnot. But you know, I also care about the vibe. It's I okay. You're not, cool you're, not a, you're not a judge. Excuse me, Sassy. I didn't. I'll vote. Me, no, you're not a judge in the audio is That's I'm saying. I mean, Sassy, your audio is garbage. I ain't want to yeah. tell you. Ah! Okay. Drop and come right back, baby. And close out. Look, so oh, I want to give my vote. My vote goes for Brooke because I felt like Brooke was Brooke looked good. She was cute. Now I did laugh hysterically. I almost bit my tongue laughing when LG said Brooke's sitting up here in a baby suit in a yellow top. <laughs> I screamed. <laughs> I'm just like that thing's stupid as hell, but she funny as hell. She when she is right. said it's like Brooke ain't cute. She's sitting up here in a damn bathing suit, and I just fell out. But um, to answer the question on the screen, can you be honest and tell me who you think oh. ooh, who you think is smaller, uppity or Brooke? So. Oh. I can't put them because Uppity, I believe, uh, is short. I don't look at her enough to know. Brooke seems taller, so of course her stature is going to look different. And Brooke titties is the size of Uppity's um, Uppity's whole head. Like her titties make her look a lot bigger. Hey, me and opinion. Brooke have the same bra size. Well, you need to get that bra. Oh, <laughs> sassy. I'm just saying. Damn, oh, I just want to see you, sassy. You ain't got to say. No, I'll be in Chicago in August. I will sassy, take you. I've never seen you. Listen, listen. Stop interrupting me. I will be mm -hmm. in Chicago. I will be in Chicago in August. I will take you to dinner if you can get it together, get people to donate, get your hair done, get something to wear, and get a fucking bra. I will Maybe take you. Maybe you meet her at the mall in y'all bra shop. And then no, go you got me tomorrow. fucked up. I yeah, am let's not go bra together. shopping yeah. together. No, no, no. Absolutely oh, not. I don't have time no. for all that. Dinner. Dinner. I just put it on... I just put it on the table. If you, you want to go to a nice dinner or not, get yourself together, honey. Okay. Y'all, it right. wasn't even a challenge. Right. It was an impromptu challenge. LG made it a challenge. Brooke was already on the why panel. Y'all talking to me like people are talking. What up? What are you talking about, Sassy? You are too. Why? I don't understand. Are they missing stuff? Like, I, nobody's talking about me and having a good bra. Nobody's talking about that. I have great bra. Well, well, well hold on. Don't let me have a good bra and then you don't have I'm a good bra. I'm talking to Let's one of you. Okay, I'm just saying, let's all have good bra. You, but you don't have a good bra, though. How you, how you know, bitch? Cause we seen you. You don't well, have a. Good would you like for me to do one and do one okay, like right I now? I know one up, but it was like the third. Like, would time. you like to see it now? Not with you, one up, but in this live, like literally. Would you like to see me with stop? a good bra? You see me trying to have a quick conversation. I'm hey, Joanna. Hey, don't don't let these titties fool you, Sassy. One up, my bad, but it happened three times. I'm like, why are y'all addressing me when y'all need to address somebody else? But anyway, girl, get a bra, get your hair done. Oh yes, I'm about to put a bra on. We'll go. Hurry. All I'm arguing okay, just and don't all let that us see no talking. skin or not too much of that. If it looked like a booty crack when you turn it on like Tracy's, then we're gonna have a problem. Put me in the back, ODS. <laughs> all right, hold on. Right. She's doing all of that. And like we speaking of Tracy, her. have y'all seen her lately? No, in good riddance. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna leave that alone. A good support of Bravo probably costs more than Chef has ever paid for a meal. Levon. <laughs> Y'all heard it. Like I'm serious. I swear. And we we going we everything we going to do it on camera. So, I don't know what she going to do with y'all money. I ain't got nothing to do with that. But if y'all so yeah. It wasn't a challenge. Literally, LG made it a challenge to look like Brooke. That's what it was an impersonation challenge. They was on Nest Live. It was doing um Brooke was on lunch break or whatever and she was chilling. And all of a sudden, um when LG came on the screen, she had on the exact same colors as Brooke. Her hair was fluffed the same, and she was just doing this weird exorcist movements and shaking. I would turn the camera on, but I got somebody in here. And she was just shaking in the corner and looked like she was foaming out the mouth and everything, just trying to antagonize Brooke. And we kept trying to get Ness to put them beside each other. It took like 30 minutes, but they finally got together. Then, hey, right, about Lolo. Hey, stepson. And let me, let me throw this in there real quick. Uh -huh. And then um, Lolo. Lolo was on the panel, mind you, the whole time chilling. With her camera off, <laughs> somebody came up there. Mr. William came up there and was giving compliments to the ladies in yellow. He noticed As the fact. Usual. I know Mr. Williams. If he see a skirt in the room, he's coming. So Mr. Williams, right? Um, <laughs> Mr. William made the comments that um, the ladies was looking good. The next thing we know, Lolo then flipped on the camera. And Lolo had on a yellow bra and some kind of shirt, and Lolo was propped up in her station, looking, smiling, just hey everyone, just speaking to the camera, just hey guys, I'm here. 
Like, so Lolo appeared and put herself in the challenge. But um, that was the funny part, though. The funniest part of that whole Who is lie. this? R&Y. Is this R-N-Y? Hey, R-N-Y. Um, okay, hey, boo. The funniest part of that whole live was at the end. You look at the chat. Everybody kept saying, Lolo, take a nap. Baby, Lolo. So she was really falling asleep because somebody said she was nodding, but I didn't want to believe that. She's not she wasn't falling girl. asleep. She was she was nodding, and that's just what it was. Oh, okay. So My baby good. girl was nodding off real hard, and it then she be. said, "Well, I'm about to get in the truck, and I'm about to drive to the store." <laughs> People said, "No, nah, baby, you need to order Instacart." <laughs> like she was tired. But speaking of Tracy, what's up, Big Man TV? Hey, big man, did y'all hear uh, <laughs> Diva Tomboyish last night mm-hmm. talking about <laughs> oh, apparently it was Tracy's birthday and she had a birthday party mm-hmm. and she said she said, I went over there and you know, I was the only person she said, even MHB ain't show up Mm-mm. and I was like how embarrassing she said, want no balloons, want no music Nothing. She said, Tracy came on camera and said, well, happy birthday to me. And nobody was there. And she said, y'all ain't shit. She made it that way. She made it that way. Because we all rooted for Tracy. And Tracy loves to lie and tell stories and add names to the list. And yeah. So I guess she thought all that cash apps and stuff that she was sending him was going to get him to come to her birthday party. This bitch texting me. Um, yeah, that won't go do nothing. And I don't, yeah, anyway, is she still over there running behind him? That's a better question. I don't know. Yeah. But happy birthday, Tracy. Hmm. Uh uh-uh. uh. <coughs> Big Man TV, what's going on with you and Ro? What's what's what is this allegations and he cussing, you cussing, and you acting innocent like a victim? Can somebody catch me up on that? I don't understand it. I just wish they would get it together. I, I saw bits and pieces of it, so I really can't really uh, give anything uh, into detail about it. And let me not act like I'm really interested. Big man, that really wasn't an invite to come talk about it. It's just like, what the fuck is going on? And moving on to the next subject. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what was the next? Um, That's so annoying. Because it was one more good thing that I wanted to get into. Oh, I know a lot of people don't like and don't want to talk about, but we can't not let the elephant be in the room. Uh, he's talking about no comment. But yeah, Robin cussing his ass off and the fastest I ever heard him talk. Um, that used to be your girl. Is it to the dirt with Tracy? Sister, it is only because I've given Tracy so many times. It was so many times that I wouldn't even disrespect her and go back and forth with her until she just started telling lies. Like, and I know she always, always lies. lies. She, she, this cruiser, you got, cruiser, you got I got um, what? Um, back back, 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 back. Mute, honey. Mute. Yeah. I don't know if it's something playing in the background or what. But when she started telling lies and saying that me and Brie was calling somebody's PO officer behind the scenes, her moderator and all this stuff, and calling her husband, and we knew the girl who killed herself and all this, that's when I knew the bitch was dumb, not just crazy, and I stopped fucking with her. Like, I don't fuck with her no more. Hey, Miss I'd like, I'd like to give my credit that you are you were uh, modded by Tracy and friends with Tracy because of my introduction. I'll take that. So it's your fault? Yes. I'll take the fault. Cruiser back. Can y'all hear me? Okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. I just came up real quick. I'm gonna make this quick and get down. Nobody's mentioning or gonna talk about the live yesterday from um uh, Wilson over there. Um uh, and Simon and Simon saying uh Queen Tulsa was cute and the whole thing of First, I would have to care about any of those characters you just mentioned. I exactly. can give a fuck about Jay Wilson. Fair enough. I'll Nine with that, I'll go on, slide on down. And on the hold on, hold on. I ain't never been a fan of friend of mine. So, hold on. But hold Simon on. is the same person that was uh, flirting with Sir Liss's Benedict Dimples. Mm. Well, Cruiser, he's not saying he him. likes strands. Go ahead. He's not saying he doesn't want you to talk about it. He's just answering your first part of your hold question. On. That was just my answer to it, Ms. Right. Ron. Why we haven't <laughs> talked about it. So can you, because I haven't seen it. So can you let us know what happened? Well, it, the part I found interesting is that Simon uh, identifies, according to him, he said, I am a warm-blooded heterosexual man. I think that's what he said. Um, and then it was uh, a big deal because he said, with some of the other people, I think S. Hutchison was up there and said, well, no, you're bisexual because you just said that Queen Tulsa, I think that's I'm saying the correct name, was cute. It's cute. 
And so it became a big thing. You know, they they determined. I don't know whether he agreed to. He was very intoxicated, but I don't know whether he agreed to it. But they have they determined that he was fluid. Fluid. So I, just, I just found that interesting that, you know, they're like, oh, you coming out, you know, you're out now. And I just found that interesting that I felt like they determined for him what he was rather than him being able to say what he was. Oh, yeah. I, I wouldn't have cared about that because who is. Yeah. Which, and that's my not- thing. As soon as y'all said y'all didn't care, I was like, OK, moving on, because I don't like, you know, I ain't one of them people that come up and try to force a, a topic on people who don't care something about it. That people, some people, no, are, it is people, in people it is, some people are interested in that. It's people um, here who probably care. I'm just yeah. not one. Mm-hmm. Now, do you, have you seen the Kendra G video? I have heard mentions, but I have not seen it. Hey, Bobber. The who? Apparently, he appeared on Kendra G's dating show. Do you know who Kendra G is, Cruiser? I don't. No. Okay. Okay. She's a blog. She's real. Like she be having the questions. Like I don't know. You have to go check her out, Kendra G. Um, I don't know a lot about her. I've seen people on there with her. It's usually hood guys, though. Whenever I see him, no, and they just no, no, that's not true. So you you tell us sassy. Well, I'm just saying that's not true. It's not usually hood guys. I'm just saying she has a, a plethora of the types. Ones I've seen, of- it was it was three. I don't know if they were just Africans or what, but they were all hood. But go ahead. Okay. Well, I'm just saying Kendra is yeah, like a woman of a um particular status. So she doesn't just attract hood people in general. So it's just a dating show, it's a very popular dating show. Uh, on YouTube, she gets thousands of people in her chat. She's, I'm sure she, I don't even know how no. many, I don't know how many viewers are subby. She has probably a million. I, I don't know, but I extremely know. popular. Um, she gets to the heart of the questions and she's basically just trying to find out what people like, male or female, so that she can invite other people to like their IG. So it's an online dating show of sorts. But and so, so he's, so been, he's been on there and he's, you know, um, gave, given, he's given himself a label. Or, you know, however you say it. I'm asking. I, I don't, I don't I know. I, I don't know Simon. I mix up Simon with CJ. And I don't know Simon. I don't care for him the little bit that I do know. So I don't watch him. Okay. So I don't know. Yeah, last night well, was I the first time I, 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 I saw him. You know, that, you know, y- y'all know I watch everybody. I go to everybody's channel. What you doing over there? Because I go to everybody's channel. Uh, last night, the first time I watched him, it was a pretty funny show because it was another uh, lady on there that was just hilarious. It seemed like all the drunk people was up there last night, but um, mm-hmm. I just found it interesting, the whole thing. But, you know, I might be late because y'all know I don't be watching stuff and be watching it, don't watch it, do not do watch it, don't watch it. So, so two more anyway, topics. That's all I had with that. Huh? But, but, but stay up because you might know anything about these two. One is VS Win in court. I don't know anything about it because I don't follow her or Kiki in that um, capacity. And then somebody got some feedback still. Damn. And then I the saw second, a little bit. <clears throat> the second thing I want to make sure we all speak about um the homeless situation because I ain't even get on to the Umar boys losing that, losing that monetization, but um the dragons uh, with her homeless situation, like so yeah. First, uh well, uh, before you go into that, sassy, hold on because Joanna just joined the panel. Hi, Joanna. Oh, hey Joanna. Hey Joanna. Oh. Hey Joanna. Oh. Hello, everyone. I'm I'm hey, just, Joanna. I'm here just kicking it. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. So um, they said he lied on, to Kendra D and told her he was an attorney. And he also said he's a millionaire. Oh, God. I couldn't even read that without laughing. I but know. all right, you can go ahead with what you were about to say, Sassy. I was going to ask Rodney because he said he spoke up first and said that he knew a little bit about the VS. I do. I have the, the bullet points on the VS thing uh, and Kiki thing, although I did not see it. You want to go, Rodney, or you want to go? Uh, well, no. I, well, I just saw a little bit of uh, Kiki's live saying that she did one, you know, that she won a thousand dollars in uh, in court, but she said she's not going to pay her. She's uh, because she don't have it. So, and that's about all on that. She just confirmed that VS won in court. Hold on. She said on. she doesn't have the money to pay a thousand dollars. She got. That's the what she said. But but Is she that can go from DC, Maryland. Yeah, because I just want to say this and then I'm gonna drop down. All right, hold I on. Hate the fact that you don't read the chat from the bottom up because y'all totally missed me telling y'all that Simon is the man that dragons were trying to get money from. I got I, I, I knew that. That's why I didn't say yeah, that. I'm sorry. Yeah, I knew that. But I just saying I mix him up for some but reason. But so I'm saying let's so I think a deeper topic is if he's out here trying to get with transgender women, why is he also trying to talk to a heterosexual woman or do he thinks that dragons is trans? That's what I was trying to get. Well, I've always thought Dragons was a lesbian, but she said she's not. Um, mm. 
And secondly, even after seeing her, I still thought she was a lesbian. Thirdly, yeah. um, what was the third point I was going to make? He don't care. I think he just want anything. If you present yourself as a woman, he's fine with it, period. He yeah. ain't going under your dress to see what's there, I guess, until you get to that point. But I don't think he matters. As long as you come presenting yourself as a woman, boing, it's, it's go I mean, for him. Yeah, he, he doesn't care. Isn't his goal to get a green card? Uh, in some pussy, I guess. No, I don't. I don't think he cares about the pussy or the penis part. I think it's the it's the green card. So, I mean, if you're trans and you you know you like him and you're gonna you know I don't know, but I I don't think he has like any type of like uh, say again. No type of preference. Well, I don't know about preference because I, I don't know. I don't want to call him. I'm just saying I don't think that he has any real standards. I think he's bullshitting number one yeah. and number two. Hey, can I get something from you? Number, you know what I mean. So I don't, I don't know why people are taking him seriously. It's, it's kind of weird, but whatever. Somebody said I maybe didn't take like him serious Facebook. after I heard him say, or somebody said that Simon told Dragons that he has to wait a couple of days to send her money because, I guess because he had to wait to the pounds from pounds to you. Yeah, did he go live here recently? And have she went? Have she went yeah, live here recently? She went live this morning. This morning, right? Was, oh, okay. It was lackluster. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's the she like outside. no shade. She's enjoying this. Like she's like, hey y'all, I'm good. I'm chilling. She's making the best out of it. I will. I'm say on the beach like, with my electric bike. I'm like, but okay. that's what I want for her. I will say that because I don't want to see her depressed and crying. And y'all, I can't we, do nothing. She still got her spirits up right now. We don't know if that's real or not. I mean, exactly. Not I think she. But the thing on. is, is she entertains us. Who don't pay for entertainment? Thank you. Uh, she's what? entertaining while she's doing it. What? What are we saying? She didn't entertain us for that. That it. Um, so been I, watching. I didn't, but y'all did. It wasn't entertaining. I don't even know what are you talking about, Cruiser. For those who it is, I, you know, I, I watched it for the first time on Lovely Love for all of seven minutes yesterday. Seven minutes, always my total. Seven minutes yesterday. So what I'm saying is, if she comes on and there are some people, everybody ain't gonna be entertained by the same thing. But if she's entertaining people, then at least she's doing something and out here begging. That's kind of um not contextual, Cruiser, because she had not entertained us at the point that she was asking for the money. And I'm not mad at anybody who gave her money because I really felt for her. So if it touched you, that's good. But I don't it it neither did touch me or not touch me. But I'm just saying that if that's the avenue she's going where she's going to be entertaining people, then at least she's you're doing something rather than begging. She wasn't entertaining, Cruiser. I get what you, I guess that's what I'm saying. I guess if you had seen the live <laughs> It was, it's not a matter of like, anyway, I don't know. I didn't, I'm sorry. I just didn't get the con context. I was like, she just came on live for a few minutes to tell us like what was going on. It wasn't like, she's not in the mode of entertaining though yet. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Well, look, while we're talking about her, here she is. Hold on. Oh, good. Dragons. Lord, hey, dragons. Let What's, me up, sure. G? What's up, G? Lord, let me make sure it's her. Hold on. Cause I ain't got my finger in the... Dragon, yeah, can you I can't hear me? Hear What's up, love? Hey, y'all. Hello, um, hey, dragons. I Hello. wanted to come. I, hey, y'all. I wanted to come on because certain people sound very mad right now. And hey, look, no hold on. Before you get started, be dragons, hold on. Angry. Hold on, dragons. Everybody, can y'all go on mute and let her speak freely? And I'm gonna give her the floor. Go ahead. Okay, I came on because certain people sound so freaking angry right now that I'm in this position and the fact that I am out here putting my position putting my life putting my personal life on the front street for people to see they can call it fake they can call it whatever they want to just don't forget to call me for dinner bitch because I'm hungry. I've been out here doing my thing. I've been out here trying to trying to do something. All right. Uh, getting this target job, making sure things happen for me. It's not your life that I have to protect or I'm trying to start a new beginning with. This is my shit. So you can say, oh. She fake. Oh, she this, she that. Do not right here in my back pocket, though. 
You're not going through what I'm going through. I don't have you as another mouth to feed while I'm doing this shit. You can't judge me. Only God can. I said, those that want to help can. Those that can't help and you still want to support, hit the thumbs up, hit the like, and subscribe. I don't, you know what I'm saying, do anything. And I have been keeping a very, very positive spirit being out here the way I'm out here. Because there's nothing but positivity out here. So if I'm walking around with a bad energy, I need to check myself. This is a new beginning. No matter what nobody say. This is a new beginning for me. From where I came from, from all the fuck away across that fucking bridge. Dealing with the motherfuckers. When motherfuckers can't even get up there, when they fucking give you stories and do all this shit. And you can't even see a motherfucker on camera. And I'm right here. Right here. Showing you my fucked up bike and every fucking thing. Showing you what you got me. Showing everything. It's a hug. It's this. Shut the fuck up. You don't know what the fuck you talking about. You want to come through this journey with me? I don't think so. Then close your mouth. Close your mouth. Don't know what the fuck you talking about. Being out here ain't no fucking joke. I'm luckily, I'm built for it. Been through this shit and going through the shit that I go through. I don't have time for naysayers. I don't have time for people who just want to question every little fucking thing. When motherfuckers have been on here with their stories and they shit and come up here and ask you for something and they ain't showing shit, you just give them money. I ain't up here for none of that. I'm up here to correct shit. Like, don't tell my story and you're getting the shit fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> this damn chat is something else, honey. <laughs> so, what I would like to say to you, Drake, well, I feel is, the need to say and scene. <laughs> oh, Y'all ain't gonna do her when she's having and her moment. She was cruising. I'm gonna allow her to have her moment. Now, what I would recommend for you, though, dragons, don't allow this. You know what you're in. You know what sector you're at. You know where you are on YouTube. Don't allow these people to trigger you to a point where you're enra enraged and knowing your predicament, you're out in public. We don't want anybody to look at you like you crazy. Cause you're hollering at a phone. Let's try to let's try to. I know, know I know. I'm, 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 I, I, and I know. That's why I had to calm down just now from the smoke of square G. Okay, now look, I know they had a problem with smoking cigs too, and I was one of them because I was like, "Bitch, cigs expensive. Yeah, you were smoking I, back I, I need to smoke my motherfucking square G. I'm out here in the motherfucking. So field. let me tell you something. I need to smoke my shit. So I'm hoping you heard my earlier commentary. I said, I always thought you gave me lesbian vibes. That's no shade. It's just that you give me a more masculine energy. I think you're a beautiful girl. Maybe you should go get a woman and let her take care of you for these next no, few weeks. No, because I'm very... <laughs> no, I'm very, very aggressive. That's why I know you say that because I'm like that because of how I've uh, been and how I, what I've been through. Like, I'm very aggressive, period. I've been through a lot of shit that people don't understand. It ain't even just the shit that I just went through. Through certain shit, shit, shit. Like, gee, like, damn. No, I've seen people get killed in front of me. All type of shit. Like, I had to move around certain shit. Like, damn, this shit. I, my life is so scary. If somebody was able to peek through this shit and see, like, damn. They'll be like, damn, you went through a lot, G. Like, yeah. And you just sit up there in front of your computer and you want to sit there and judge a motherfucker when you have no fucking idea of what of what I saw, like, of what I've been through as well. Like, yeah. Well, you know, can I ask you something, though, on that as we watch you? Uh, and don't take it as, as judgment. It's just, uh, uh, you know, we, we, we humans, so we form opinions. Isn't it what you chose, though, in a sense? I told y'all I chose to make my life like this to get out of 
a certain dangerous situation. You think I wanted gotcha. to choose being a fucking homeless for a, a lifetime? That was stupid of you to think like that. Then why do you know they are like that? Here's why it wasn't stupid. There are no, some people you. who do choose this. We, saying, we're not arguing, no, honey. We're having a conversation. But, and yes, I know you're able to because no, I've heard you speak crazy. before. That's but there are people who do indeed crazy. choose homelessness <laughs> and choose not to have a home. There That's are people who choose is. that. I, I well, get that, I but I ain't, I'm not Dragons. like that. I didn't choose to be. <laughs> I ain't choose to be. I, I'm finna give me Dragons. a crib. I have a question, sweetie. When I get my shit together. So you uh, say you don't want to be homeless forever. You chose this path just out of curiosity. I, cho I chose it temporarily I got to get out of trouble. To get out okay. of that trouble Let that me was ask over you this, there, though. I chose to put myself in an uncompromising situation so I could get back on my feet. So I could do things a different way. Let me ask you this, because I don't know if anybody else has asked you this question. I know your mom is in Chicago. Yeah. Just out of curiosity, why not go back to Chicago to start to just get you a break? Can't go back there because I won't go back there. Number one. Number two, that the ex is back there. That crazy ass ex back there. So it's I drama. Okay. Okay. Drama. Um, dragons, I'd like to dispel something because I remember about a year ago, uh, you were doing your own braids, and it seems like this is a big point of contention, at least in the chat. And I think I overheard other people talking about it. Did you do your own braids? Yeah, and I need to do them again. So if okay. anybody want to send me hair money, I'll do them bitches again because I need to do my hair again. Seven hundred and fifty dollars braid hair costs ten dollars. So okay. But I just wanted to braid your hair don't cost ten dollars, girl. It costs two ninety nine a pack. How many packs do you need? Probably like um four for the okay. black. So for the white. So stop the cap. So that's ten dollars. So anyway, that's over ten dollars. Okay, twelve, girl, please. Okay, because you know I'm already, that's I'm already, over, helping, that's, I'm already helping you out. So let's stop. Okay. But anyway, well, I was mad. Don't get mad. I'm not mad at you, baby. I'm just saying, don't semantically. Don't <laughs> come to me to death about twelve dollars. Ain't nobody saying man they can shit. I'm just, <laughs> okay, just saying. Anyway, I'm I need to, to redo these motherfuckers. Okay, good. <laughs> I, I get you. But I just wanted to have your back on that because it seems like everybody's like asking, oh, well, her braids, her braids. She does her braids herself, you guys. It's not a lot. They don't look bad. I don't know what's under the hat, but they don't look bad. So stop with the assumptions or believing everything people tell y'all. She did not spend two or three hundred dollars to get her hair done. She did it herself. I just wanted to say that. And then before you came up, I was telling a cruiser had caught me on guard with the entertainment thing, but I think I was missing her point. She was just saying at least you weren't begging that you were trying to create content. So I was wondering, I did not find your content today to be cohesive or entertaining, but I'm wondering, are you in a position if you're in this position? Like, are you? Wait, what, are, wait, I'm what, asking, what, wait, asking, what they, what they say? I spent two, three hundred dollars on hair. No, they didn't. Say, they're such. They, they we're over that, honey. We're over that one. I, I cleared that up for you, so you're good. I would never do that, even if I was straight. I would never do that with my own money, G. <laughs> no, <laughs> two, three hundred. Damn hair. I That's know. Crazy. Yeah. But let me ask you this question to Cruz's point about you know you needing money, and I know it takes time or whatever. But are yeah. you? In a, are you in a position to start vlogging your life so that you know what I mean and like being a little bit more coherent with what's going on with you and like doing that type of show? I can. I have to find the charger. I haven't been able to find the right charger. I might have to go to Target. I've been through a couple of places this morning and they do not have the one I'm looking for. So now I gotta go to Target, which is the job I apply for. <laughs> I got they keep telling me to go to Target, go to Target. I was like, okay, damn, I gotta go all the way down so, there. To let me it. ask you, have you got an ID? Yeah. Well, not a Florida one, but I have an ID. The yeah. expired one? Mm-hmm. Did still you, work? Did you go get okay, but did you go apply for a new one or not yet? I can't go get it yet because I'm in the process of getting the birth certificate. Okay. okay. I, have so to, I put that in I put that in wheels. I put I put that in wheels. I put that wheel in motion. Right okay, I good. To, so, yeah, so the process yeah. with the birth certificate, what have you done? You yeah. reached out to them online? I reached out to mom and then I reached out to them online. Okay, good. Yeah. That's what's up. So that's that's in the ball of rolling. And once you can get that information, you can go ahead and secure your job. Is that correct? I already secured the job. Uh I got an interview 
Like, no, you did I not secure the job. Oh, oh, yes. No, no. I got a no. Yeah, I got an interview. If they don't call you in for after, because after the second interview that I just did, if they don't call you in for another one, uh, that's that means you ain't got the job. You just the third interview oh, yes. that I've been through. What? Well, yes, Effie. I ain't secure it yet. You right though. I ain't secure it yet, but I feel like I'm gonna get in. I keep positive spirits to it. Yes, it's all I'm, I'm there, claiming. Yeah. I'm claiming it. I'm yeah. claiming it's this coming. shit. Yes, Keep I'm out. claiming it, baby. Yes, I'm claiming. Steffi, go ahead. Chat rep. Well, just oh. so y'all know, I did not buy the uniforms that go with the job. I bought work clothes. The work clothes that are needed like black pants black shoes black socks i bought the fucking work clothes that's needed g for me to be able to go up in there and be like oh, i'm ready because when you ready they be like okay well you look like i know where to put you and this and that. i've been told that before so all you got to do is go there ready to fucking work look you know have dressed in black so that's pants, what you made with shirt. the purchases that's that's what you use the donations from nessa and lemons chat to get not, not all of it. Not all of it. Not all of it, but some of it. I used it to get work clothes. Yes, work clothes, G. That's work good. shoes, work clothes, okay. work socks. So it's not my place to ask, but someone is in the chat asking, did you re do you want to confirm? Did you receive a seven hundred dollar worth of donations? If I if I uh sit there and go back on it, I don't think I received seven hundred dollars. That's your business. I was just wondering because they asked but me. Shit, I could go back and count the shit. Like I wasn't counting. Um, shit, not, not like that. Uh um. All right, all right. Hold on, hold that they thought. They want me to go back and confirm that. I mean, I will. But at the end of the day, what do That's I owe that person? Controls. What you do good. I owe that person to share that information? You don't. don't you answered I enough don't right there. Me. Hold on, because I don't want to feel like I'm badgering you. Let me do one thing real quick. Can you go on mute for a second? Um, MBK, yeah. I had asked you to come up here before we got into this bigger conversation. I wanted to no, kind of no. get an idea of what your plan, Joanna, can you mute, please? Um, oh, what, your, what your plan was when you go to the spaceship. So if you're still here in about 15 minutes or so, I don't want you to have to just hang out here if you don't want to. You can come back up. Yeah, I'll come back up. Yeah, Appreciate it. Yeah, just, just let me know and then I'll pop back up. Yeah. Appreciate you, bro. And I smoke a lot, so I might forget. So, yeah. Um, Nessa, hello. Hello. Pleasure having you here. Um, give real me, quick. Uh, I have a, I'm having a microphone problem. Um, mm, give me a second. You I have to come right back. Okay. I'm, right back. I'm glad she hit you the panel because I want to ask about this man that we saw on her panel yesterday, y'all, that she didn't answer uh -oh, me. Oh, what happened yesterday? I was Don't not worry here. about that. Don't worry about that, baby. Can we I trying to ask a quick question? <laughs> you got bigger problems, baby. Hold on. Go ahead, R&Y. Okay. Um, I, Dragons, I don't know Let if me you... Her. Hold um, on. <laughs> Dragons, I don't know if you um, talked about this yet or even addressed it, Thank but I heard good. something about um, that this isn't the first time that a story like this has come out from you. Is that true? Because I heard like audio of you talking to somebody else. Well, the first time that I went through a situation where I came from Chicago uh, from a domestic situation. Now, he didn't beat me, but he was trying to take my life. And I wow. ran from that. He, mm. I ran from that. He was trying to set me up. for. Uh, he put my name in false documents as far as insurance fraud claim. And I found that out. As I was trying to get shit out here in this world, I found out there's some shit in my name. He was trying to steal my identity and give it to some bitch. He was so they was trying to take my life. And that was the first situation. The second one here is the fact that this motherfucker didn't get what he wanted. And he said I owed him and I didn't owe him shit. And while I thought he just let it go, he kept trying to circle around the crib and shit. I was already like wanting to move back on south beach but like he kept starting shit kept coming around there acting like he was checking the mail just so he could come over there and basically cause arguments and like riffraff over there and shit so i felt like it was too much and even the landlord had talked to me about it but i'm like well you should have more better lot for the shit because i'm like he shouldn't be able to walk up in here and fucking knock on my door and be able to fucking start shit with me because i will you know what i'm saying I had to call the police on them, but I will call the I was like, I will call the police again. So noticing how he wouldn't stop, I left. That's why 
it comes in to where I chose to do this because I said I would rather go through this, get some help, get on my feet rather than to go through that shit back there where my life is in danger because a motherfucker can't get what the fuck he wants. He's not a fucking mafia member. He's not no none of that. He's just Cuban. He's just a fool. He's just a Cuban fool. Okay? This mm-hmm. motherfucker is just a fucking idiot. And he just want to be on bullshit because he didn't get what he fucking wanted. You know? And he stuck. So I have a question. Because I remember shit. yesterday I was listening to the situation. And you mentioned, well, first of all, were you and this Cuban man in a sexual relationship of any kind? No. Okay. No. All right, I don't want to go in deeper on that. That was just the first question. So secondly, yesterday you said it was something to do with the toilet not flushing, remember? He broke the toilet, G, before he left. Do you know the ball part? When you go into your... Yeah, so it just keeps running. Yeah, yeah. You know that ball part when you lift the lid off your toilet, you see a black ball or a white one in the middle of that water as it uh, helps your shit. He broke the shit and he left it underneath the toilet. I was wondering why I was sitting there. Gee, tell me why in a couple of months the water bill shoots the fuck up. Mm. And I take the blame for it. He's no longer there. And it, it goes on my bill. <laughs> now, now technically, was it on your bill because it was in his name? No, it went It went on me. It went on me because he left. Okay, but he was trying to get... Um, um, he, w- he was trying to get the little, the little money that you get after you leave the crib and shit. But the deposit? Yeah. Yeah, he was trying to get the deposit and shit from him, and he couldn't get it out of him. So then the nigga tried to muscle me for the shit. <laughs> well, not nigga, but, you know, the guy tried to muscle me out of the shit and then really got pissed when I was telling him, no, I can't afford that. I can't give you that. And at the end of the day, no, I don't owe you that. Like, no, you move me in here, and then you're going to say some. you'll give me $200 on my first month, uh, on my first month's rent if I need the help just to get me on my feet. Now, who the fuck says that? And then they turn around and say, you owe me $800. Now, tell me the truth right here. It's just that, me and you. A motherfucker that, don't, a motherfucker that, didn't, want to get, that didn't get their way. All right, so look, Dragon, it's just me and you right now. Nobody else is in the room, all right? Were you running drugs for this man? No, I never touched no drugs. Did you no steal drugs? drugs? I wasn't, no, I wasn't touching no drugs. Ain't no drugs involved. No. When no drugs involved. I don't Maybe. do drugs. I don't touch drugs. And I don't be around drug dealers. It wasn't had nothing to do with no drugs. Okay. I don't do that type of life. That's not my okay. life. Just wondering. Just I mean, because it's definitely given you was you in the life, you you running the streets, like you living like a nigga on the streets, like with the I'm living la vida you. loca. Look, <laughs> I'm living la vida loca, but I ain't living that damn crazy. Okay, no, I ain't touched the damn thing of drugs, and I damn sure I'm glad I had to. Like, no, hell no, no. So right now, when you abandoned the house, who took over the house? Because you say you just left. You ain't the you just landlord. Left. No, the landlord. I call. I know. I'm in good communication with the landlord because he know every time when he came over there and he started some shit with me. He knows they had to get family and all type of shit. That's when he got it. When he when he got his family trying to get his family on me because their people had rose up against him towards me. You know what I'm saying? Because he kept coming over there starting shit. So that's when he went and tried to get his little family and shit <laughs> and tried to call some bullshit where I was. So that's why that's why that happened. So I was like, you know what? I'm not, Instead of keeping this little war going and all this bullshit, you want to outnumber me with your family and you want to lie and shit. And I can't All of this over a leaking family. toilet and wanting to get the deposit back over the apartment. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You got to pick some better yeah. friends, baby. Oh, wow. All that over 800 fucking dollars plus the 5,000 he sent the man in the fucking hole with, with that toilet. It's $5,000 in debt right now. That toilet. The water bill. Oh. So, so, okay, so at this moment, I don't want to get too far into your business, but at this moment, do you not have a roof over your head right now? I do. I told y'all that. I do. I go to the hostels and shit. I live off the grid right now. I live off the grid. Okay, the reason why I asked is because yesterday in Code's uh, morning commute live, someone dropped down um, and said that they provide... I'm sorry? 
they can't speak for me. They don't know what the fuck. No, 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 no. Listen to what I'm saying. They didn't speak for you. What they did was they dropped down in Code's um, morning commute live and said that they provide um, resources for people in certain positions. And they gave the address to where they were. And I don't know if somebody directed you over there. I wasn't there. there. No, I wasn't over there. Okay. I, well, I just wanted to right. let you know that somebody by the name of Nita Meyer did drop Are they in beach? Uh, are they in Miami Beach? Yes. Really? Mm -hmm. What do they do? What do they do? It's someplace. Hold on. Let me take. Let me look at the picture right quick. What Brenda, they when they with? said the Cuban part, I guess to know the type of people she's dealing with, I guess. And knowing Miami is, you know, like. I guess that made a difference because it's like the gangs. That's the hood. Yeah, but ain't no gangs. I ain't been affiliated with no damn gangs. <laughs> okay, it's called I ain't Camilla's with house. None of that. Oh, I know about Camilla's house. They the first house that I wanted to go to, and they fucking told me they full. Even with when I had the reference from the um fucking police, okay. <laughs> they the first house that told me they couldn't care for me. Okay. Yeah, been no there. I just wanted to let you know that that was out there. Thank you for answering my question. Yes, mm -hmm. ma'am. Mm -hmm. Well, the first ones I went to, first ones, and I tried them again, and they still was full. Now, do they I know where you are? Do the, you haven't been in contact with the Cuban man or any of his people since you've been? Hell on the no, road. hell no, hell no. I ain't been out there. I left quietly. Okay, I left quietly. How Quiet. far are you in distance from where you were? You over an hour away or? Uh, I should say I'm like 20, 30 minutes away, but he still don't know where I'm at. I'm, I'm not scared for my life with him because I know he was bullshitting as far as like, you know, trying to do anything by himself to me. But as far as like sending him over here, over there to try to intimidate me and all that other shit, I'm like, okay, well, y'all had ample amount of time. Well, I was going in and out the crib and y'all sat there in a fucking car, you know. So I just was like, before anything transpires, before they even think they could get a battery in their back, I fucking left. I was leaving because it was getting too close. It was getting way too close. Now, when you say it was getting too close, was he sending verbal threats to you? More like actual threats toward with people, using people to kind of like intimidate me to show up and be fucking trying to swarm the crib, like kind of trying to walk around when there ain't no traffic, no way. Like I, I used to live by school and it, it wasn't no traffic around. There wasn't nobody just hanging out over there and just standing around and shit. Like I knew that was for me. So when you say it was three Cubans in total, you seen three people looking at you or gritting on you since this situation happened. I never said it was three. I don't remember like you saying that. three Cubans. It was the like part. five of them. I, it was like five. It well, was, it was more than three. It was more than three. He sent fa his family. They wasn't Cuban. I mean, they wasn't mafia Cubans. I mean, but they was his family. I met them. That's how I knew that it was them. Like, how are you going to send his I was. That's why I said, how are you going to send his family over here? Because he can't get $800. And he broke the toilet, and he don't even want to pay the man. Can't pay him, but you can pay eighteen hundred dollar fucking rent. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Jackins. Can I interrupt real quick? Um, and these were men or Are you women? looking at me for the money? Can you hear me? Um, we had. I Hold had on, three, down, Dragons. Hold on, Dragons. There was three men. She asked me, "Is it was all women? It wasn't like oh, three yes, men and two women?" Oh wow! I, you know why I wanted to ask because I was like, was it kind of like, a, oh, we gonna send our cousins after you? But to have men after you is so aggressive. So I think that I, my first thought was either drug running, drug mm -hmm. mule. No, hell so, no. You know what I mean? Because that no. sounds dangerous. No, he oh. he went he mad because he couldn't get the money, and I told him that when he um and I told him for helping me out, I was already gonna hook him up with something on my way out. But then since he didn't want to wait. The computer he stole from my crib, he put it in water and then gave it back to me. Fucked up, so that huh? diminished his whole little eight hundred dollars. You see what I'm saying? It took it away because you're not gonna ruin my shit. You stole that from my crib, trying to get a your daughter that you deported from motherfucking Cuban, a Cuba, and you want to sit here and get her my shit. I made him get that shit back, and before he gave it back, the motherfucker put it in water. I had to find that out through the Geek Squad. 
when I tried to get that motherfucker back fixed. He put it in water. So that meant his $800 go bye-bye. I don't owe you shit. And you fucked up that man's toilet and put that bill on me. Please. I'm going to pay that much money for what? For what? When this motherfucker acted like a child, been childish. Sounds like they were trying to um, flush you out of there by any means necessary. I saw him. Yeah, I, I kind of felt that too. Well, I you wouldn't leave. Too. You wouldn't leave, right? Hell no. I was paying rent. Why would I? He was just mad because he was paying $1,800 rent, but I was paying 800 But then when the toilet got broke, when dude found out, when the landlord found out, he went up on my rent. And it, the shit was a thousand dollars. He went up on your rent because of the toilet. Yup, he so, went up on the rent. G, I so had to pay a thousand dollars, so I was paying a thousand dollar rent for like four five months. G, before I left. Yup. Hold on. So your rent was twenty six hundred because you said you were paying eight hundred no, and he was paying eighteen. Twenty six hundred. I never said that. You going along with everybody else story? I'm t- telling this. He, no, didn't never pay eight, he never paid eight, 1800 The rent that was over at the place I was was always $800, not $1,800. He's paying $1,800 right now at the place he left to be at. And he was mad because he couldn't afford that. And he was trying to get $800 out of me when I didn't have that. You understand? My rent was always $800. You understand? He went up 200 because of the broken toilet. Instead of fixing it. He fixed it, but I still had okay. to help him pay off the bill month by month. I still had to help him pay it off because with uh, dude being gone, it was just me there. So let me, let me help you. Let me help you. Drag. The bill went on me. The bill let me went help on you, me. Baby. So what you're saying is that whatever, let me, I'm just going to put a number out there. Okay. So what to fix the toilet was a thousand dollars. You didn't have it at the time. So he just, it was not a thousand dollars. I just, I I just said estimated. that bill went up into $5,000. Okay. Five, five, right. five. Okay. Can we clarify something? Okay. So is the man mm. that is after you, the landlord or the man who moved out into the other apartment? The man who moved out. Why would the landlord be asking me? Because you keep saying they raised the rent to a thousand. No, he, no, he, that's not why, no, he wouldn't be after me. He cool. He looked out for me. The landlord is cool. Okay, but the motherfucker who who had the lead. Dragons, dragons. Who raised the rent to a thousand dollars? The landlord. (laughs) But he cool. Okay. Hugo. Yeah, he. No, he he had I'm to. I'm trying to help you, Dragon. Have, you have listen, to allow- listen, listen, you, you listen. Who and had to be held? Them. Who had to be? Who had to be held accountable after old boy was gone? Right. Me. Right. So let me let me say this uninterrupted, okay? Because it's very hard for me to talk like that. So what I what I'm trying to summarize, summarize from what you're saying Dude is that had to make his money. Can you please? I'm here to her. Go ahead. So what I'm the some I think the summation is. The the other guy, Julio, we're gonna call him, the apartment was in his name. He got pissed at Dragons for whatever reason. He wanted her out. She would not leave. So he left. When he left, then the rent now the rent has to be paid by her. But when the that's landlord that's not true. That's not true. Let me, let me I see you trying to get it. But that's not true. That's not even that's let not even the case. Well, let her finish that's and that's then you can debunk it afterwards. That's not it. That's, that's not, not it. it. That's that's not it. it. That's that's Finish and then correct me. But it's you're wrong. not doing a good job at it, so at least let me I try. I am. To do- it's my life. You just you're not getting it. Good job. Oh my god. I don't want to yell at you right now. I know I'm not trying to yell at you. Just chill for a minute and then correct me. I'm not saying I know. I'm saying this is what we, we're trying to figure it out, honey. Okay. So somehow the other man left. It left her in charge of the bills. Somehow the landlord found out that there was damage to the toilet so whatever damage it was to the toilet he tacked on a little bit at a time on her rent now making her rent from 800 to a thousand but some then the main the, i don't know why this is part of the one thing i want you to tell us then the landlord is cool just give him his extra 200 pay your 800 but somehow the dude whose apartment name is actually in him and five of his relatives are coming after you. And it threat- wasn't in his name. 
It wasn't in his name. I, I, you could go ahead, but it wasn't in his name. No, you go ahead. It wasn't in his name. It wasn't. No. So how was he supposed to be granted the deposit back if it wasn't in his name? Because you did miss it. Ran, because he said ask the question, Juwan, and let her answer, please. Okay, okay. Okay, because he said he rented the apartment, and Hugo said that he had a verbal contract with him saying that when he moves out and if the apartment is kept in uh, mint condition the way I gave it to you, you will be getting a deposit. Hugo verified with me over that, okay? But he did it, <laughs> and that's where the nigga fell. So that's why when I when he put all the certain bills on me because he was gone, couldn't find his ass. He put the shit on me, G. and so I had to pay two hundred dollars extra rent because of that toilet. Okay, so who's, and then who's... while I had to do that, hold on, while I had to do that, I got this motherfucker here barking down my tree, barking up my tree, circling around the crib from here and there fucking trying to intimidate me with people over eight hundred dollars he was never fucking gonna get because his ass fucked it up in the first place so was the apartment in your name dragon after i after i was able to uh transfer everything over yes it was originally whose name was the apartment in well it wasn't in here because hugo told me he rented but when i got the place i signed papers it was so in when you moved after, in, they were already stand, when you moved in, they were already staying there, or did you guys all move in together? I moved in with him. Oh, okay. I moved like okay. I'm he was already there, but um, he said he was leaving because he was getting his kids from Cuba. So when he was leaving, I was already getting the paperwork ready. So when the paperwork got done, G, it was a wrap. So ain't no I owe you shit. So, thank you, Joanna. You asked some good questions. Um, I have a question, and I have to ask this directly because somebody did send me a cash app to ask. Um, mm -hmm. I know you say you're not doing any type of drugs or anything. Are you on any type no. of psych meds? No, I don't do pills. I don't do none of that. Okay. No, I don't, do, I don't fuck with none of that shit. Oh, okay. Uh, I want to ask this question: Was there? Do, was there any drugs involved? Period with with the uh, people or? Mm -mm. Um, mm -mm. No, he was pretty much an old man, y'all. He was just an old fool, and he did things foolishly. There was no drug. He don't do drugs, and neither do I. He wasn't on it's drugs. Me, he was just fucking, right. he was just fucking ignorant for oh, his Lord, age. I Sorry, right, me. I didn't. <laughs> he was just he fucking ignorant. Yeah, he was just fucking ignorant and stupid for his age. So he you're saying that you legally did paperwork, signed something yeah. with your social, and became responsible mm -hmm. for an apartment that you have mm -hmm. since abandoned. I had to abandon it, and I told Hugo I was going to abandon it because I'm not going to deal with none of that shit. So, quick question. If he's a landlord, he's, he's your right. landlord, he doesn't have any other properties that you could go to or a better situation to put you in? He did say that. He did say that, but they were all over there, and they were not on South Beach. And I needed to be on South Beach again, honey. All my resources is out here that I'm taking, uh, utilizing right now. All my resources is out here. I couldn't, uh-uh, I couldn't, uh-uh. No. Now, when you he say your resources are out there, can we elaborate on that? What exactly? Jobs, housing, link car, motherfucking certain stores. Thank I mean, jobs. I mean, come on. See. Now, jobs. Now, so I'm not got just a link situation, card already? but I definitely got questions. I was in this situation it's last coming. year. It's coming. Oh, okay. Okay. So, yes, we want to speak positively about it, but wouldn't the situation be better received to be in a place with the home to lay your head a public uh, with the actual address so that you can apply to jobs they can respond to you and you have some sense of stability while well, you're you getting don't have it i would love that i would love that but, but hold on you're I telling me I you need to be on it. south beach now to my understanding yeah. i've only been to miami a few times miami is that's for the tourists that's for you're gonna be spending money on the beach you ain't about to get no 800 dollars rent on the beach no 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 yes i will but it ain't gonna be on the beach, G. It's at certain places amongst this place where I found really uh, low That's rent, deep. and I can rent every month either an apartment or a room. But I do. I'm, I'm like, why not get my money together and just get an apartment? And I already got somebody that's gonna co-sign, which is the housing authority. And 
they gonna get me in a place once I have all my money together. They they told me to save up three months worth to show me to show them that I got the, I I could take care of and, and make sure I have the month every the rent every month. So they already told me what to do. They just said just get working, and I said okay, thank you. You know I already talked to housing, so all all I gotta do is work and and save the checks. Okay, so let me ask you this, Dragons, right? You said all you have to do is work, right? Mm -hmm. So when it comes to work, I also understand that you have to have an ID. And I also understand from yes. what I was hearing in the streets that one of the jobs is willing to give you a grace period. So they do. Once, Target. Okay. Target. That's Target, baby. They, okay, so I, I have spoken to them about and, it. Okay, so yeah. once you get your birth certificate and stuff, what address fine. are you going to give them in order for them to send it to you? I'll get, I'm, they're going to have my P.O. box. They're going to have a P.O. box. That's so do you have to have a valid and up-to-date ID to even get a P.O. box? No. I already been got that, and I got it off of the invalid um, ID. <laughs> I so I know I had to give up my P.O. box because I couldn't afford it. So it's good, like, wow. long as, yeah, it's like long as you got my an shit ID. My went from $89 to $300 for six months. So if, she, yeah. if she's in somewhere with the system, like what she mentioned with the link card, that could be, and she claims that she's homeless, that 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 it will they will allow her to get received yeah, mail. Yeah, they, they did. Okay. Mail. So and I have they received did. another question. And they um, did. Dragons. That's exactly what happened. In the last three times, the last three times, in the last three years, how many times have you moved, sweetie? Um, probably only once or twice. And what is it twice. about South Beach that fantasizes you so much? Like it's you, not about South she Beach. She said the resources. The, oh shit, I forgot. Yeah, it's my oh, okay. resources. I've I been out here before. Data. It's resources. I've been out here before, and this is just somewhere I want to live. This is also somewhere God showed me to live. I got certain things I gotta do out here rather than just be homeless and get out the situation. I have certain businesses I want to do and certain things like just because I'm in this situation don't mean, oh, why are you out there in South Beach? It costs so much. Why are you out there? Blah, blah, blah. Listen, I'm out here for a certain purpose. Yeah, so you, you, think God, you think God sent you? Dragons is a dreamer, y'all. So if we can go along this line of questioning. And I, I definitely. Not, that's it not a dream. dream. It is a dream because it's not when reality. When God gave you a vision of it's something. It's a dream. And it's where when God sends you, he also uh, um, gives you provision. Let me say this. All right, y'all. Hold on, hold on, hold on, everybody. And not only that, it's not a dream. And when God shows you certain things you have to do in your life in certain places that you got to do it in, if you were paying attention, then you would know when he does that and you would have no problem with We're not going to talk about what I'm talking We're not gonna about. Get I've always wanted to be somewhere paying. where I can grow, though. Right. I've always right. wanted right. to right be now, somewhere I can right. grow. Right. Now, I'm going yet. to grow. I'm going to grow. Like, I'm not, I'm not saying, oh, now dragons, you're in dragons, a situation. Dragons. Like, you're coming for me right now. No, I'm dragons, not. I know it's frustrating, that. Dragons. No, dragons, I know it's frustrating. It's not being positive. Dragons. Dragons. I can make it. Hold on. So you're not going to listen to I have a question me. for her, too. Uh, All right, hold on. Let me get some order. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, everybody. So what I wanted to say was, Dragons, I appreciate you for coming and joining the panel. We yeah. were going to have the conversation regardless. But what I would like is, I don't want you to feel overwhelmed because nobody is attacking you. There are questions. You got to understand. People are going to have questions for the, from now until the rest of the time that you're on YouTube. So if you could, please, because I need to go to the bathroom. Can y'all, can we all talk? If you hear someone else begin to speak and you've given off the first part of your sentence, go ahead and kind of listen to what's being said because you don't have to give us the full backstory because we don't want you to overshare, but we want to make sure that we can get an understanding and get your point of view as well. But I don't want everybody screaming over top of each other and I don't feel like all that mutant shit. Okay, so, and yeah, I get that because I'm not here for no nobody's attacking uh, you. I promise you that nobody I don't is like the negativity. I understand it, but you got to understand the, where we are. People are going to have situation. questions. So I understand. It's still sunshine. It's still so, let me say, so, so let me say this, Dragon. So, so let me go to back from y'all handle this. I don't think Ness or Don have spoken. So really quickly, honey, I want to be very clear with you. I am nowhere near being negative. I, I that was the first thing. I somebody asked me the first thing I said is we all been through ebbs and flows, and sometimes 
the the you know the 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 end of the rainbow is far away and sometimes it's near. So I'm not I'm not in a judgmental state or anything, but what I am in is in a realistic state. And what you're talking about, other resources and trying to be able jobs. To I'm talking about jobs. <laughs> That's let me unrealistic. Finish. You're not. You didn't let me finish. You didn't let me finish. So there's no way okay. you understand. All right, ma'am. All right, ma'am. <laughs> so having getting a job at Target is a great start. Okay, you have not. That's secured. a great start. Uh, uh, amongst from who else? Uh, uh, hey, Dragons. 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 You just told me you would you would be willing to have the conversation, baby. Relax. Okay, I am. I am. Go ahead on mute. Light this. a cigarette, please. Come on. Light a cigarette, baby. <laughs> Let her at least get it out. She's not attacking. Now I understand when she talks, it might, you know, you might feel a little bit offended, but she's she's generally doing what everybody else is gonna be doing. She didn't knock the stuff off. Go ahead, Sass. She'll be right back. Good luck. Ness, Ness and Don can go. Well, I had questions for Miss well, Nessa I... anyway. Hey Nessa. Oh, sorry. Hey, Nessa. Hi. Can you can you guys hear me? Hey yes. Nessa. Yeah, yes. we can hear you, girl. Okay, perfect. Yeah, good. Good afternoon, everybody. I just came to to kind of hang out with ODS. <laughs> Oh, um, yeah, that's all. What's good? Yeah, I appreciate that because I'd definitely be in your bushes. Your your panel has changed. You switched mm -hmm. to the third string, so I I kind of <laughs> watched from the bushes. But I came up the other night and I had a that was last night and I had a good time. I didn't come to fight LG because I know that that my boo needed me and she missed me. But instead, she got Rodney with his little sweet booty. Let's see. But um, who was that man that popped up next? Um, what man? ODS. His name that's was India Lodge. His name was Tehran, and we all saw him. What? What? Who was that? He's on my members only wall. <laughs> um, I I don't know. I'm sorry, I'm not sure. Hey, hold on. Maybe it second. was a different got, line. Too many people in the back. Hey, back chat. I'm gonna drop you real quick to see who the next person is, and then I'll you can come back up once they go down. I got just Krista. Just Krista. I'll, BBW. Come, I'll come down. I'll come down. All right, thank you, Cruiser. Um. Oh no, no, don't let her go. Oh. Oh shit, Cruiser, come back! Oh, no, snap. I forgot about that. I did what? too until I just thought about a title. I saw just Crystal was going off yesterday. Relax, and she had several yeah. names in the title. No, that's why I clicked the link. Uh uh. Let me go on mute. Let me mute. Hey, just Crystal. Hey, hey, everybody. I'm so sorry. Hey, um. Dragons, come back now. The studio is not full hey. anymore. ODS. Hi, uh, just Crystal. Hi. I can't see the other names. I ain't got no glasses on. We got Pizarro, Sassy, RNY, J Dunn, Joanna, and Ness. Hi, hey, just Pizarro. Hey, 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 everybody. Come on back, Dragons. I didn't even see Pizarro. Okay. Me no, I, wanted, just noticed Pizarro I wanted to ask uh, Cruiser a question before it go any further. Okay. So hopefully she'll come back up. Do you want to go ahead and put it out there now? Uh, yes. I want to know. Uh, was she coming for me over at Mr. TiVo's yesterday, along with TiVo's sister? And I just wanted to be clear because I don't want nobody to say, oh, BBW coming for somebody else because she had a lot to say about me yesterday in Mr. TiVo's um, chat yesterday. So I, I just wanted to be clear on, on what's good. Where we at? Who was Mr. TiVo? Mr. So TiVo was Mr. T-Velocity. T-Velocity. So hold on one second, because I got Cruiser in the back. Let these two ladies have their little moment of conversation, y'all. It don't include any okay. of us. Oh, all right. Thank you. Did you watch it? Yes, I watched it. Oh, so yeah. you watched it. So was I, I, watched, I watched stuff for myself. Yes, I don't want nobody to be giving me misinformation. Absolutely. Absolutely. Respect. So did you see me on the panel? No. I wasn't on the panel. So in the chat, um, you saw me laughing at comments that went on in the chat. Lady, do you have a problem with me? Don't keep questioning me. <laughs> you have to determine that. You that you got to determine that. Was I do laughing? You, at I don't have to listen. determine a so mother. Let me answer your thing. question. Let me answer your question. I have no idea who you are, and that is the truth. I don't know God. who you is. Right. So I couldn't have a, 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 a issue with you because I don't know you at all. That's why I'm asking truth. you. Right, so that's, why that's my you. answer. Now, was so I laughing, she was in, the, was I laughing in the chat at the commentary? Absolutely, okay. I was. So I you, always okay. laugh. You, if somebody's in saying some funny stuff on a panel, okay. I'm going to be laughing my ass off Kiki and like well hell. As, as well as you give a comment on it too, right? 
And you gave us a I, comment on it too, right? As long as I am a grown ass lady and play my mortgage okay. and my promo and nobody don't and give me that, I will see y'all on her birthday on my channel. Bitch, I got that ass, okay? Bye bye, nephew. Talk to you later. Can I please? But no, we don't have, and, and listen, honey, we're not going to have no issues. You're going to be over there talking. And, and and folks gonna be telling me, I'm be like, don't run that stuff back to me because me and her ain't having no issues. I don't do be doing no manufacturing beef with people. I'm not arguing with somebody because they mad because I because I was laughing at a chat. That's childish. Anything else? No, nah, thanks. She said she'll see whose birthday coming up. God bless America. Whose birthday Wait, coming Ms. up? Wait, Miss Cruza. Oh, she, well, she said she'll join her on her birthday. Mine is we're gonna like with yeah. your little um your little guest backstage. We'll discuss that at another time. Oh, yes. Go ahead, Joanna. I said, mine's is in July, if you care. <laughs> Girl, I don't. Um, Mine is on the 29th, me and Chanel. So, no. so well, Dragon Ball. Go ahead, J Don. I'm sorry. You and Ness didn't have any, but Ness was just chilling. So, go ahead, J Don. Yes, I hope that I was patient enough for everybody. I want to thank everybody because um, that whole interaction right there, everybody stayed out of it like I asked. Thank wonderful, you. Wonderful, Jadon. Just, I mean, just so much, so many flowers and kudos to you, darling, because people don't give you your flowers. <clears throat> they sure don't. Um, but my seriously, because I've been listening to everything. Drag is when you had to get away from that situation. Did you get listed as a protected person? Is that the reason why you have to be in a certain area to get the resources? Because that was one thing that I thought about. No, no, I didn't. Now, when the first one was after me, I was trying to get that. I was trying to get that data. I was trying to get that D, but I couldn't get it because they couldn't find him. And they, but they noticed I was being tracked, but they could, they were trying to catch him. And I, 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 I couldn't get it they they needed the shit to be at close uh uh proximity whatever the fuck they say close proximity proximity, proximity. yeah, yeah I, and and i tried to get that <laughs> it's funny you brought that up i tried to get that girl I cannot. But I was just curious because I know it is a lot of resources when people have to be a protective person. I wanted the protective job. I wanted to be a protective service. Custody is the same as protective class. I was trying to get that shit, G, and I couldn't, G. He had to be in close proximity of me and try to, like, do something, do something, because they already had cases they told me that he was under as far as murder and all this shit and yeah, so I was trying. That's why I was trying so hard, but I couldn't do it because they said he wasn't in close proximity, even though he was in the same city as me. So he was in, he was in, he was here, but he wasn't close to me. So they they couldn't do shit. And but now you, know, you like just you, you just said the man done murdered someone. You said the man done smuggled his children across the, the border. But then no, you say, no, 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 I didn't and say and that. You, and then no, we're talking, talking about a different man. We're talking about a different man, Juwana. <laughs> no. Oh, okay, okay, I'm sorry. It wasn't, sorry. it wasn't him, honey. Oh, okay, my bad, my bad. Juwana, if you fuck up one more detail, you're going to have to go back to the chat. Okay. If you fuck up uh, one more detail, you're going to go back to the chat. <laughs> no, no, I'm talking about the man that she had to leave Chicago to get away from. That's the man yeah, that, that I was talking that about. One, yeah, that one I tried to get protected of custody from. Yeah, they wouldn't let me get it, girl. They told me he wasn't close enough to like do anything where they could catch him because they were so watching, but he, he couldn't find me. So while they couldn't find him and they knew he was close, they could, he could, they, the, the enemies couldn't find me. So I have a question, Dragon. Well, but, but, okay. but I just want to make sure that y'all understand that I'm saying protective person and not protective custody. When you are a protected person, your information and identity is pretty much off the grid for your own safety. Are you saying like oh, I, I, had, I had oh. I had to go off the grid on my own. Uh, on my own, they didn't help me do and so, nothing. And normally, they, they have resources for people in that type of situation. So that's they, why I was asking. They should. Like they should. But the they, they, they told me. Yes, they told me something. They told me. Listen, they told me something would have. They told me something would have had to happen to me already. 
Where I, I survived got you, it. I'm gonna answer it. Hold. On. I'm gonna ask it. They so, told me I would, uh, something had to happen, uh, or like basically, I was I, I had to be able to catch this man, and 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 my own little shit here. He couldn't catch me, so it didn't happen because they can't they can't pull that case. They said if even further if the man is not close to me, but they saw him. They were tracking him, but he couldn't track me. So this case went very weird, and they're still tracking him, but he still can't find me. So I went off the grid by myself. I've been went off the grid before this even happened. I've been was off the grid, not putting my address and anything, getting a P.O. box, having it sent to the uh, post office, all that shit. Like, I've been living off the grid as far like as a my drug mission. Like a yeah. drug No, I'm so I want to address the question on the screen. The fuck, man? Okay. So the question that? on the screen says, how do we know what she's going to do? Is she's going to be responsible with the money that's being sent? So in code, the only thing I can say in response to that is if uh, you're if you're willing to send her something, you're doing that in the honor and trust system of your own. She yeah, don't have to provide do nobody any receipts. I got you, boo. I got you. Relax. She ain't got to provide nobody no receipts. I didn't send anything because I ain't got it to do it. I mean, to be honest, got bills myself right now. You still in the same spot you was in. You ain't moved. Okay. Yeah, I, um, I she ain't got nowhere to go right now. Just walk around in a circle. Just get your step in. Shit. I ain't walking around in circles. This is just a spot that I could be at while okay. I'm online. Okay. While I'm online, can I My get bad. that? Like, bad. damn, this is it just, was, one just of a the little spots. joke. You, you're in a good Ooh. mood. Just stop it. Come on. So look, I know you don't want to go to your mom in Chicago. So you ain't got no cousins in North Carolina. Nobody in Georgia. She always knocks herself off when she um when when it's a serious question. Well, no, I think she'd be trying to turn her camera off if she hit the wrong button. Oh, okay, yeah, probably. Yeah, because it happens. Did every she time say she has some place to sleep tonight? Why y'all mad? Cause she got a uh, cause she mm -hmm. got. A I have yeah, no yeah, man. She says she's in a hostel. No, I she know. does. Okay, yes, so she has a hostel. Here's yeah. my question. So she says she got an electric bike and she can plug her phone up to charge it on the bike. The bike I saw looked like that bike from uh, 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 Mary Poppins with the basket tied to the front. She put so, the basket on there herself, and there's okay, a so little battery patch that's attached with a there's scarf a in the middle. Attached. Yeah, you have to pay attention, R and Y. You can't there, miss it. There, yeah, because you're about to get kicked off like Joanna. There are. Okay, I'm gonna be quiet. Going back on mute. Yeah, it's electric bike. Yeah, she showed us that <laughs> now. Lovely love cussed Bree out yesterday for that, and she showed us her bike, and she showed us how she had the battery yeah. charge plugged up with the. Now this well, all, they're is all lined up. They're all when you go to South Beach or any type of uh, tourist spot, they're all like literally lined up. Scooters, bikes, and you just like put the money in and and go. But like, this is her own personal bike, though. This isn't. Oh, a South I thought Beach. she had rented. Oh, cool. And and for her saying on, that, um, Amazon they're not lined up. The city bikes are lined up like that. Ain't no damn That's scooters what I was out talking here about. I lined up. I Ain't I guess no damn scooters about. out here lined up. Now when the people are Miami standing up. Ms. Those Darling, this is the same scooters, question we had. Listen, mm -hmm. those certain scooters where people have to stand up and they ride, those you have to pay for. I've seen I that. Yeah, we're aware but, of that. We know about those. Hey, look. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I don't have much other, time left. Others, like with yeah. bicycles like mine, we got that, that part, baby. We don't need to pass on, on that. No. Hey, hey Dragon. We got that part, baby. We about nothing, baby. I was just talking to R. Yeah, the bikes, that's not important. We got it. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So I know you have major resources in the FBI. I remember a time when the troll and her bestie were hacking your computer. So did you um, exercise those resources to reach out and let them know you were in a predicament yeah. with the Cubanos? Yeah, they're still, they're still doing it. Yes. This yes, is the American yes, 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 I did. Okay. Yes, I did. Okay. Um, and not only was I guided to come here by God and myself and Amen. knowing where to go, they told me, get somewhere where you know it's safe and we'll stay in touch. So I told them where I'm at and they're like, that's perfect because we work with the district over there. It's good. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. Now, what's the fifty dollar battery that you're trying to get? Is that a battery for your camera, your it's, phone? It's not your fifty dollars. It should be thirty something, forty something dollars, but it's with tax. I'm trying to get the fucking the battery G to where I can uh go anywhere without plugging. Cause everywhere I go, I don't have a plug to for the bike. Not a, I, no, no, no. Oh, just the plug phone. itself. It's it's for the phone, G. For the phone. For the phone 
um, I need the to get the portable battery so that I can be able to have a charge everywhere I go well, you didn't get and the be money. able to I, and it helps me to be okay. online it you helps me to be on my live you can get a good battery pack from Walmart for like twelve dollars okay hold on uh, the, out here we don't have a Walmart out here yeah uh, in Miami in Miami party does we got a for target a lot we of got that. a Ross. Maybe we got bus. certain uh, you can ride the bus to stores Fort Maybe you can ride the bus to Fort Lauderdale and go to Walmart. She don't even have to go to Fort Lauderdale. You can go to the Walmart on 163rd. You can go to the Walmart in Miami Gardens. I mean, there's several Walmarts. And we got the troll living in pork and beans. No, no, I don't know. There is a portable one. I just recently started using it the last month. It's uh, called the Power Bank on Amazon. And I think if I'm not mistaken, she can't use Amazon. They got pickup oh, yeah. spots for Amazon. You gotta have to have yeah. a valid ID to even get to the locker. No, they have lockers. You no, can order your stuff to go no, straight to the no, locker. No, no, She's showing y'all the battery. So Hold on. Don't have to have an ID. No. Who's that at the bottom? I know. Oh, that's your mom's ass. You don't need a lot ID for a locker. It's just that's the portable one we Joanna. can take with us everywhere, Joanna. You want me, Joanna. That's it. Oh, I have one of those. Oh, anyway, the bottom one. You still have to charge those up, too. Okay, yeah, yeah. I want the black one. I like the black okay. one. Would you want the, the black one? I like. I like the black one. Where do you send that to her hospital, please? What color it is? How much that black one go for, Joanna? She can send that to your hospital. Don't worry. Okay. No, she has a PO box. No, I honestly think, y'all. I honestly I, I, think I, that if she put a wish list, I'm glad God that said no. God if you, said. if I put a wish list together, that'll be just extra. I don't want to go you that didn't far. Make enough now. money. You didn't make enough money to to afford thirty dollars for a charger. Well, she got her clothes for work. Remember? No, I'm asking yeah. her. Did you well, know? They sent me. Head. They sent me some money for when I got that. I got that. Through the people that look out. I'm sick. asking about because the charger. No, did you not sick. get enough money for the charger? Oh, I did. I did. I told them yesterday. So I got it. I just I'm on the look. I'm on the lookout for the right one. Dragon. Because when I went, I told y'all on my live. When I went, I forgot. I'm sorry. What happened? What the bottom line issue? Why haven't you gotten the charger yet, honey? Okay, so as I said on my live today. The reason I didn't get the charger that I wanted because number one, the stores that I went to already had them little freaking um those little uh shits that look like mozzarella sticks. They had they had them little cheap looking ones, and I needed a big pack like how Joanna showed. I needed that big pack. I need so, a big pack. So Ness is telling you to go to the one on one fifty third, right? Yeah, the yeah, one in North Miami Beach. Bridge. That's across the bridge. You're gonna have to get across the bridge for most things. Let's you act like one. You of got an electric bike, bro. You're not, not walking. Yeah. She can ride the bus. Ain't the bus free? To, no, to, it's no, like five dollars for a free. day pass or something. That shit, uh, is, that shit is exactly five fucking dollars. Well, that's cheap as it. My my thing is dragons. I just I'm just concerned that you're gonna get comfortable with hitting links because every time you hit a link, people are gonna no, try to help you out. And I don't want you to you know just keep hitting links, telling the story over and over again. To that, and when I'm days are passing, over over when again. days are passing, you are, and you need listen, to be doing you are on the same page as me. This. You are on the same page as me. I've been fixing my situation. I do not want to keep having to tell this over and over and over get, and over. Get, you want to say, listen, no, listen, don't no, hold on. I wasn't get, finished. I wasn't it. finished. You I wasn't done. finished. You I wasn't done. finished. You wasn't done. finished. Done. Can, you me, can you let me? Can you let me get it done? Can you let me get it done? Give her one minute, Sassy. Let her wrap up what she's saying. Oh my God! I'm about to have to go in a few minutes. Go ahead, Dragon. Oh my God! I'm trying to get this done. I don't want to be sitting out here doing this shit all day or sitting here hitting panels just to be like, okay, I'm in this situation, this and that. I want to hit the panel for fun shit, for other shit. I don't want to hit the panel because I'm in need, you know? And while I do want the sector to look beyond this, you know, my whole thing is, yeah, I'm in this situation right now. Yeah, I'm going to need some help. If anybody could look out for me. Until I at least get to my first paycheck, I'm good. But I'm not gonna sit here and be hopping links all. I'm not gonna be sitting up here hopping links all day and be sitting up here 
fucking and you even uh, have talking about it all day until okay. people are tired in the fucking mind about well, this Well, that's shit. what we like, do here, I'm not Dragons. Gonna you know that. Doing all that. So, Can Dragons, I you know, no question hold on, Dragons. All that. So you know that's gonna happen with or without you. We can like you won't hear when the conversation started. We still gonna have the conversation, mm -hmm. and I'm being as respectful well, as possible. Well, so you tell Question, old girl now, that. Let me go you ahead tell and old girl that. You real quick. Who is um, old girl? What I will say is, you're all right. So I understand your situation, and what I was always told was beggars can't be choosy. You're saying you're in a situation where you ain't got a pot to piss in, a window to throw it out of, and nothing to wipe your coochie with. But you're telling me that, oh, I don't like that battery because it's not blue and it's thin and it's this and it's that. Like, you have to humble yourself, like, drastically because the cash apps that you might have received, they're not going to continue, baby. I'm going to just let you know that right now. <laughs> These people will feel sorry for you. The more this situation goes, the worse it's going to look for you. If you're thinking you're going to come and hit panels and people are just going to act like they forgot that you just said you was homeless and you got all this shit going on, you in the wrong motherfucking place. I'm going to just tell you right now. So what, yeah, what you okay. need... What you have to do with yourself is you have to put yourself in a position to either leave this shit alone and watch it from the clouds until you're able to pop back out and say, oh, I got my shit together. Or you had to go with the flow because the same people that you asking, while we might not be the ones donating to you, the people who watch us and support us are. And if we're asking you questions and you're ducking and dodging, and you're not able to provide a good recap of what's going on. They're going to stop believing and you're going to lose every trust that you got. And I ain't saying that you're lying about any of it because that's I hope that you wouldn't. Cause that ain't gonna do number set you back further, but you do need to humble yourself. Cause right now you should be wanting to take anything that can help you succeed. And I ain't saying lay on your back and do some shit. Cause I heard some people say that that ain't what I said at all, but I'm just talking about using the tools and resources, get the fuck out of the most expensive place that you in and get some other. You, you better go sell that pussy. Go ahead. When it come to the charge, well, I was just saying when it comes to that charge, you know, if you get the little, I, I done had several of those. If you get the little small one, it really does not keep a charge too long. And so I do believe in her investing in a power bank type of charger. If she's going to need it to last for several hours a day versus her just having a charge just because she out and about. So that right there, you know, I can understand her being... Um, choosy with that because even if she get the little small slender one, it might hold about two or three hours of a charge. That's no, really that's nothing. True. That's true. I wasted my money on one for the airplane. The little ones are crap. However, done. Mm. We're on. We're on day five of me no of us knowing this situation. Correct. It don't take five. It don't take five days. Just like Nessa just knows. Boom. One fifty third. Get on the bus. It's a five dollar day pass. Go get your $30 charger because you do need it. She needs it. I don't mm. want her to be out. She Fuck. does need it. Fucking dragons. You can hear me. I'm going on mute. I'm going to drop down. Fucking make it happen. I'm on your side, girl. But it's tough love time. It's day number motherfucking five. Stop with the goddamn dreaming. Get your motherfucking birth certificate. Get a, a driver's license if you don't have warrants. If you do have warrants, tell us the truth so somebody here can help you. Fucking make it happen because this shit is about to run out and no single woman needs to be on the goddamn street of motherfucking Miami. Okay. Thank Take you. Up. Hey, look, because I have to wrap this up soon, I want View to speak and then everybody can give their last statements and then we're going to move to the next live. Um, Miss View, how you doing, baby? I'm good. Hey, hey, uh, ODS and hey, everybody. I just want to come in real quick. Um, hey. I remember, hey, hey, yeah. I remember when you, I was on your live, uh, Miss uh, Dragon Lady, and you were like, oh, yeah, I remember you, View. We was beefing. We was in a major beef. And I was being real nice and polite and stuff like that, but I don't remember you at all. If I do remember you, it was with some fuck shit. But I'm going to tell you right now, you can't get a job unless you have a goddamn ID, okay? Unless you're going to get paid under the table. And at some point, under the table, shit's going to be caught, okay? So you with the fuck shit, girl. Go ahead. You scam me. You want to get some money and shit? Just go ahead and ask the people because we will. Now, I do like the fact you got a little, little bit of halfway game, but girl, you asking for all this shit? And you pedaling around in the bicycle. You said you're going to get a job. You got clothes for the damn uh, Target. Target you is not don't start you no know, shit. Target, not no shit. You and you know damn well. 
don't remember you. You've been in this same you predicament, but you, you had a car. No, I know I'm don't old, but do God that. Damn, don't God fucking damn do that. You don't, be, don't put me into your Why are you trying to do that to me? And why you got so much animosity towards me? When I said nothing to you about nothing, it's funny how people turn on you when you get in a situation that they have been in. Don't add me to your fuck shit. What the hell going on with you? I didn't know it. I thought you were just like, oh, well, maybe I did see you and say hi and stuff like that. Because some of y'all knew people come over and talk to us. You've been in this same and I don't even know who the fuck you y'all are. So this is a prime example, okay? Wow. I don't know the girl. Wow. I don't know the name. Wow. But don't y'all give All this of this shit talking. Me. Okay, thank I'm you, I'm supposed to just sit here you. humbly Whatever, and take bye. that. Whatever, bye. Whatever, bye. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Everybody oh, gonna have an opinion. You gotta understand. Everybody gonna have an opinion, right? Ooh, Ooh, Joanna, can we get your last words, Joanna? Oh, Joanna, my bad. No, no, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. So you next R and Y or whoever. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. So my question to you, Reckless Dragons, before I drop down, is this: I understand that tarot cards may not necessarily work on yourself. So my yes, question, they do. Yes, they, they do. do. Okay. Yes, so, they do. So, I saw my situation. All I knew was I needed help with food. And to like get certain shit along, I knew that, but okay. I ain't know who to ask, and I was scared to ask the uh, B sector because shit, you know, you got certain people who won't let this go for years, and then oh, you know, and all this extra shit. So it's like, hey, for me to come out and expose my life the way I'm doing that shit, and how it's being hey, done, dragons. whatever the fuck. You my can get a moment to give your closing. Let okay. her finish her statement so that okay. way she can. Okay. So, I gotta move it out because I gotta so get I'm up out of here. This question and I'm okay. gonna drop down. Why weren't you working before this situation? That was my next question, but go ahead. Thank you. I was. Uh -huh. I was. I told y'all what happened. I was working. The site went down. I was working from home, and their site went down. So you should have a last and final check coming too, right? They had gave me that already. I had already received that. It wasn't just me who was calling in the midst of that. There were other people who are readers. Yeah, we only, we only know yeah, you. Yeah, I wasn't baby. the only one, G. I wasn't the only one. They're right. me down. And well, I still work I still work for two other ones, but there's the um the clientele is slow, but I can't live off that. So that's why Dragons is looking for work right now, and Dragons is trying to get work. Now, being okay. as though their systems went down, great question, verbal assassins. That didn't qualify you for unemployment? No. But okay. unemployment, they have a, a, a help desk or an IT department? Or another job. They, well, no. but that's the thing, y'all. Y'all can't y'all can't forget that the man dumped her computer in the water. Remember, she said that. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, well, you right. Right. Thank you so much that. for answering my questions. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that. Thank you, right, Jay Don, because they mm -hmm. they forgot that. Thank you, Jay Don. We did. Jay Don is very good with um, keeping up with points. Joanna, can we get your last words, please? Um, sure. Um, I really don't have anything. Um, they said right. if I didn't donate, then I shouldn't have an opinion. And I will well, have a great day. Well, Joanna. Thank yep. You um, I enjoyed my stay up here and you guys have a blessed day. I'll see you around. Me the Thank you. We'll see you around. Sheffy, I know you just got here. How can we help you, sweetie? I would like to be the last one or close to that. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll just jump in. Go ahead, Nessa. Um, dragons, I don't know why you don't want to do a shelter. It, I think that that's would be your best bet because it is Ain't a no one-stop one. shop. I, I'm going to just get this out. It's a one-stop no shop, one. but there's more than one. And I feel like you're I not looking that. at others. They I will help do. you with everything instead of you having to do it by yourself individually. So I would hope that you would look into that more because I promise you there is a bed somewhere in Miami for you to rest on. You guys have a good day. Thank you, Ness. And Ness seems like she could point you in some directions. I mean, knowing that she is Miami. So maybe you could hit her up and try to get on her community wall, go to an old post and get some advice or get some suggestions from her because she know and that's know the streets. Go ahead. Can um, I Jay do Donna. my final work? OK, thank yeah. you. So I even told Ness, Ness left the bed in Miami. I told her that she should allow dragons to go over there to her mama. But they said no. Right, because all, all those have. places are full. They're full. They won't let me go. So if she got a certain place out here that's not a shelter, because I try all the women's shelters. If she got a certain place that I don't know about, please tell me. Because that's all why these we were telling you to get on the full. bus and come out of the South Miami, out of Miami South, because you ain't gonna find it there. Them people are concerned. But look, I already know that. That's why I'm, uh, and then I'm already in the process of getting work. 
and I have to work from out here. I got certain shit covered. My whole thing is because I'm up here by my storage. I can't lose my storage. Um, I'm, I want to be close to my storage that's mm -hmm. out here, awesome. plus awesome. the jobs and shit that's out here. Look, right. I can I do this, y'all. I, I, I can do this. I can do this. I, 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 I can do this. All right, hold on, Sheffy. Um, I can't give you last because you weren't here the entire. Um, Sassy is my co-host, so she will be last. Cause so, can you come on? Yeah, I was just uh kind of wondering what was going on, ODS. You had hit the link and you was uh telling all my business and whatnot. I was wondering what was going on with that. What part of your business about you dating a um illegal immigrant man? No, you got the name wrong and everything. You live. You that was on another that. live. That wasn't here. No, I understand it wasn't here, but I was like wondering why you just hit the. Oh, so you pulling up on me? Okay, hold on, let me put myself. Well, on. I wasn't trying to pull up on y'all. Just wanted no. to ask you. A question. I did call CJ Simon. They both seem like the same scam. No, type. it wasn't CJ and Simon. No, you was trying to pull up Simon, and it wasn't Simon. Anyway, did you want to contribute to this part of the conversation, daughter? Yeah, nigga, I'm leaving. You have any advice for arm um, dragons? Well, and if anything, I, I told Dragons, if you actually need some help in Illinois or Chicago and you need me to, like, send something to you or whatever or get a message out, please let me know. I'm not trying to dox you or anything. Um, I just can't provide for you monetarily. However, for me to put the work in or time, I can definitely do that for you. Yeah, if she you got the bus out there, can she stay in you. Thank you, Chad Rep. Thank you, Chad yeah. Rep. I, you I know, definitely appreciate it. Yeah, you know where I'm at. Like, I'm really... Like, you know, everybody know where the fuck I'm at. So if you really do need help besides me and you always fighting, I really I want know, you to be right? in a safe I really want you to be in a safe place. Um Yeah. Thank yeah, you. I'm a, I'm gonna talk shit about you too, but you know, I just I know, you it's too. okay. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's all, all right. right. Thank you, Steffi. Pizarro, you've you been very nice. You only cussed her out once and told her to go sell her coochie. Um, <laughs> I, but I understand y'all have a past relationship due to her FBI calling on you. Did you have anything you like to add? I didn't call on her. I didn't call on her. Child. Well, if I did have anything to add, you added it for me, didn't you, Big Big? <laughs> I ain't calling on her. Right. Now, why you lying? Now, why you lying? You got lie. I didn't. Girl. I didn't. I think I you're lying about this whole situation. I ain't gonna even lie to you. No, I'm not. But no, I'm not. Don't say that, Pizarro, because that's that's not why? true. Why? Like, come on, man. I'm going through this shit. I'm out here, and it's ain't nobody gonna just sit out here when they could be in, in the inside of their crib if they had one. I gotta go. My son might need help with her skin. All right, appreciate you. All right, so Miss Sassy. What up? Oh my gosh, such an interesting show. Thank you so much, Dragon. Thank you for co-hosting the entire two hours as well. Thank you for allowing me. This was this was a good show. You know how the beef sector uh, ebbs and flows. So, Dragons, I want to say a lot to you. I'm going to be real real succinct, though. Um, Thank you. Uh, absolutely. I want to, like, really uh, shout out to you for staying up here, you know, for not bowing out, because I know this has to be hard on top of it's life. Hard. I know it. I know it. So believe me, my heart goes out for that. Right. My heart goes out for what you're going through. I yeah. believe I believe you 100 percent. Right. I, I do. I just want you to know that I absolutely believe what's going on. I think that you probably made some bad choices. This isn't your first time making a bad choice. So that's why we're hearing these stories that may seem like plays. You know, it's it's the nature of the beef sector now to believe that everything is a money grab. But um, I just go off my energy. So I just want you to know until you prove me wrong, I believe you. OK, the second thing. Right. The second thing that I'm not going to do too much. I think I did enough today. You know where I stand. I'm not backing down on that. I think you're dreaming too much. I think you need to humble yourself expeditiously in my T.I. voice. You can shake your head all day and I appreciate you. I'm, not not, I'm, I'm humble, but I'm not dreaming too much. G, I, I got it. Like, I just need to get this. You don't I just have need it. to make sure the you job is straight. You don't have it. 
You don't have not it. Yet. Not, not, yet. Don't have not it. yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not only do you not have it, because a lot of us don't have it. Okay. Uh, we might seem like what we got it. Some what let, you let, mean? Let, you let, mean? Let, I don't have it like that. So finish thoughts, because it's very difficult for me to communicate that. Way. I don't have it like that, but I mean, I can live out here let me like finish everybody else. Let her get her last I thoughts. You gonna have your moment right after Dom says. I mean, right after. So a lot of us, even when we you think we might have it, we still don't have it. But not only do you not have it. It, your shit is fucked up. It's it's at it's the bottom. God is trying to tell you something. If I was on my live, that's the shit I would play. Hashtag color purple. God is trying to tell you something. You have to humble yourself in these situations. You just have to, honey. And then you have to start action because all of that dreaming without work already doing that. Ain't nobody sitting not there doing on my it fast ass enough. Though. You're not doing it fast enough. You need to be, this needs to be urgent. This is serious. This is life or death. You do not have it. That needs to be your mantra to actually get the fuck and have it. You don't have to have these bullshit ass mantras. Please understand that I'm moving forward with everything that I'm doing. And I've been doing this shit since I got out here. Ain't nobody just sitting here just twiddling their fucking fingers, though. No. Take it with love. I will not talk about this with this much aggression again. Okay. I've said what I said. I don't need to beat a dead horse. And I do want you to feel like, you know, there are people out there that, that are. I that, know. And you said try harder and I'm going to try harder just for you. Don't try. Don't I'm mother try try. try. No, I'm going to try harder. Don't I'm going to try harder. Do I already do been it. doing harder. Do I already it. been doing it. Thank I already you. been doing it. I got Thank good you. news. I got good news to tell people and I couldn't even say it. Like, All right, look, so look, you got two minutes uninterrupted because I got to go. Go ahead and get your last words off, Dragon. But just to let you know, this was not done in the efforts to try to belittle your situation. Is to bring some enlightenment to it and allow you a chance to speak. But people gonna have questions. You cannot expect that nobody won't have questions, especially the people who are giving out their money. I know all of us ain't giving out nothing, but we do have our right to have an opinion because it's here on YouTube. So I hope you take it, receive what's good, throw out what you don't. Go ahead and say your part look, so we get about it. You got two minutes. Look, I understand what's going on out here. And I understand that my situation might not make a lot of sense to a lot uh, of people. My whole thing is I am doing for day for day. Since I came out here, I've been out looking for a job. I was like, oh, only thing I need, need to do, find a really good job or two really good jobs and make sure I'm straight out here. I already know the cost of living. I already know all of that. Okay. So my whole thing is that as long as I get myself situated with the jobs, I'm situated with my place of living. That's not dreaming to me. That's actual planning and motherfucking making sure that I can do shit like that to make sure I can live the life that I need to live. That's not dreaming. That's not a dream. I don't understand what they mean when they say a motherfucking dream. That's not a dream. That's reality. That's reality. All right. I do want to thank love you. And I love all that came through for me. I love you all. And like I said, if you want to help me in my situation, come through for me because I definitely need it to help me get to the next level, uh, two and three. Okay. At the end of the day of this situation, I don't care about the negativity. I just need the positive people, positive uh, actions, and that's it. I don't need none of that stupid shit. I'm talking about I ran from a cartel and all this extra stupid ass shit. Like, no, that ain't my life. I ain't been on no drugs, ain't dealt with no drugs, ain't got no no affiliation at all. All right. Well, I hope you get to into your position for the night. It's about to be dark soon, so. Try to make your moves, get your dinner, get yourself in a position so you can be comfortable charging your device and all that. Make your way to get that charger that you need and do the things that you're saying you're going to do. So that yeah, way I'm going to try to come back online. I'm going to try to come back on live tonight. That's what I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that now. Well, I'm going to tell you what's important right now is not going fucking live. But you do you. I can't tell you how to how to navigate your day and night. But just know if you do come live, expect people to be in a position to judge and have things to say. Yeah, they have, um, uh, as I'll long be as you continue I'm to provide to... a place for it, they're going to continue to break it. But I got to go now, so you go okay. enjoy your day. Okay, I got uh, you. Thank you for coming up, and it was done with the Thank most respect. You. I know I can be hard on people, but 
Yo, I gotta treat I you know. like a little because your ass. Is I out know. Right. Go find <laughs> you a woman to go lay up with, cook you some spaghetti or something. I ain't finna do all that, but thank you. <laughs> Bye. Um, <laughs> Bye. I do want to shout out. Yes, you can. I do want to shout out the um chicken challenge. There's going to be a fried chicken challenge this weekend on Saturday. I was trying to get eat with you, but she didn't see my comment, and I ain't have a four ninety nine. I wasn't about to spend that on super chatting for her to see it to see if she would come be a judge for you, Pizarro. But I tried to ask. Some people saw me in the comments. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed this live. It was only supposed to be a test because they said stream yard was broke, but apparently it is working. Thank you all eight hundred and sixty of you that's been in here. Hit the like button on your way out. Um, dragons, get your situation together. I'm not here to judge you. We all been through something and going through something that nobody knows about, but you got to humble yourself. Unfortunately, right now, cigarettes don't look like they can be in your budget. And I'm just coming from a person who smokes mad weed. Ain't nobody buying it for me though. Ain't nobody about to buy, you know, cigarettes. You don't want to pay $5 to get on the bus to go get a charger that you need to make sure that you can listen to and use your phone, but you're willing to pay for some cigarettes, baby. No. Or stop turning on your camera. We don't need to see your every move just to try to prove your point because it kind of can hurt you instead of helping you. If you see it fit in your heart to want to help Dragon in her situations, please check her um, page out. Somebody might have dropped it in here. If not, Dragon's after the live comment below. So that way y'all can go subscribe to her. Her cash app was on the screen the whole time. Um, other than that, thank you to everybody who came up and contributed to the panel. Miss Cruza and Jess Christa, I'm watching y'all to see what y'all got going on. Other than that, um, I'll see y'all who next on the lives because I got to get up out of here. This was definitely not the plan or the move, but I do love y'all. I appreciate y'all for coming through and I'll see y'all in the next video. Thank you for the cash apps because I definitely did receive some cash apps. Um, I was gifted some memberships. Anthony Smith, thank you for the 10 memberships. Naturally Butter, thank you for the five memberships. Miss Parker, thank you for being a member. Sophisticated Brett, thank you for being a member. Jim and I love for becoming a member. Demis O for being a member. Um, tell her what I offer. I apologize. I missed that message. And then I missed this as well. Black Rampage. There's always a boogeyman in her stories. Dangerous, exclusive, shadowy character or after a group after her. She's a mentally ill addict. Ooh. Hey, the people falling out, but thank you for the super chat. Um, and other than that, thank you all for being here. And I hope y'all enjoyed the show. Um, Retro Babe was also saying she was in need. If you can see it in your place to help her, you can do so. I ain't got nothing to do with none of these people, but thank you for everybody coming up. Love y'all. Tanari, I'm glad to see you. Been missing you. Y'all have a good night. Y'all said she got a hickey. That's her business. Bye.